I'm back. Uh, the only the only other problem that oh, I didn't even put my AFK screen up, or did I just turn it off? The only problem is like the time. You know, like I just don't have time to learn a game like Sea of Thieves or um, like anything like that really. And uh, I love the way that my life is structured right now. I'm not complaining about it, but you know, like all last week I had my son at night. So it's like, I get up at 6.30. I get my, I get my son breakfast. We were at school by eight, 8.15. I come home, take a shower and go live at nine. You know, stream nine to 4.30, pick my son up at 4.45. You know, I'm with my son from 4.45 until he goes to bed around nine. And then at nine o'clock, I mix a drink and I come like chop up VODs and edit, you know, YouTube videos and shorts and TikToks until, you know, 11. And then I go to bed and I get back, I get back up at 6.30. I do the, I do the same thing over and over. Um, you know, there's, it, I'm basically either streaming, sleeping, or with my son or editing videos. You know, it's like when I think about, when I think about a game that I wouldn't stream, I just, I don't have time to play the games I love. Like, I would love to play more Helldivers. I have like four hours in Helldivers. I would have loved to play the last Path of Exile League. Well, the last two Path of Exile Leagues. Um, there's a whole ton of like indie base builder uh, strategy games I would love to play. And I just, it's, there's just not time, you know? <laughs> he doesn't even have time to learn Valheim. <laughs> that's, that's great. Great, that's funny. This is, uh, well, A, I, um, I, I quit my job about, well, August, last August. So to answer your question, I have been in, um, sales and relationship management pretty much all of my life. Um, my last job was, was basically doing sales for a data company, selling financial service. Well, I would say data services to banks. Um, I quit my job last August because it wasn't the right job for me. And I decided uh, as I'm getting older, I don't have many other opportunities to try to be a full-time streamer. So since August, I have been full-time streaming. Um, I've been very, I'm very, very good with money. Um, I could live a couple of years off of my bank account without putting myself or my son in any financial risk. I have a very strong resume. Um, so to answer your question, I've been in, uh, you know, relationship management, account management, most of my life. Um, and I'm streaming full time now. This will not support me. I will most likely be going back to work, uh, probably in the coming months. So yeah, my day job has, like I said, has been relationship management, which is a sales function. It's like I work for companies that partner with other companies to find ways for them to, you know, either grow, grow sales, uh, reduce fraud, reduce shrink, uh, increase bottom line. Nothing personnel related. Like I'm not going in and telling them who to fire. Nothing, nothing consultant like like that. But um, that's what I do. So. I decided I wanted to try full-time streaming and uh, if I had like, if I had like four years, I, I see a world in which I might be able to make it, but I don't have the timeline, right? Like I, it, chances of me making it, the chances of me spending four years trying to build a following large enough to be able to sustain myself doing this. Like if I was like, I, I mean, keep in mind, single dad, you know, I own a condo, I own a truck. You know, my son obviously has to be paid for, for, you know, for daycare and his toys and insurance and all of these things. Um, it would be more reasonable if I was a younger person without so many um, kind of familial commitments. But yeah, this will probably not work for me full time. I probably will be going back to work in the, in the coming months. What if you blow up one day and hit a 1K viewers? I'm not convinced. Well, <clears throat> A, I'm not convinced that I will blow up. There's a, there is a part of me that thinks that I will regret giving this up. Like there's a part of me like two years from now that would be like, fuck, I might, I might've been able to do it. Um, but I, I don't believe that I'll blow up. I don't believe that I'll ever be a one K viewer type of streamer. I, I don't, I see other streamers out there who are better, smarter, funnier, uh, more passionate about it, 
and they're not 1K streamers, which means like people that I admire that have been doing this for years and years and years. People who I'll buy by all of my own objective measures deserve to be 1K viewers and are not really leads me to believe that um, I'm, I'm probably not going to be that guy. So that's, you know, that's that's kind of my that's my take on it. Again, it, like, but also, and Gray knows this, the, the amount of things that I would have to do that I don't want to do to grow are also large. Like, I'm uh, there's a bit of self-sabotage in there. Like, I should be streaming less, and I should be focusing on creating better content. Like, I, I make the laziest, like, YouTube and TikTok content, right? Like, I put, I put zero, I put zero effort. Well, I don't want to say zero. I put zero effort into the quality of it. I'm just, like, clipping funny things that happen and uploading it because that's all I care about is that memory has been saved, not necessarily that I'm riding a meme wave and, and trying to get a million views, like that type of stuff. If, if, I, if I really wanted to give it a little bit of a shot, I would probably have to stream maybe four to six hours a day and spend another two to three hours a day just learning to be a better editor, you know, learn it like it would definitely have to be face cam on. It would have to be doing tutorials and tips and like all of this shit that I just don't want to do, you know. Um. Yeah, I mean, I think that... I mean, I think that is what it is, right? Um, I don't typically measure... I'm going to be honest with you. That doesn't bother me as much. That that doesn't bother me as much. Because, like... Do I think it's unfair that there's amazing small creators that are being overshadowed by just things? Whether it, it, it falls into that category or not? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But... I don't even really factor any of that into my calculation, right? Because, A, there's just, there's just, it, those people are choosing to create content just like I'm choosing to create content, right? Um, I don't, I don't judge people for making that content. I guess, I don't know. I, I, I don't have an intelligent, I don't have, my, this is just my gut. My gut is it doesn't bother me. If, if somebody wants to put themselves on social media because they're, they're, pretty and they want to show off their body or they want to be in a hot tub i i honestly i don't it doesn't bother me one bit it just truly doesn't it's so far a i don't i don't really watch it um b that's their choice c fucking good for them they're not working some shitty nine to five if they're happy doing it as long as they're not being exploited in any way as long as it's their choice and they're happy doing it um I mean, would I rather they're working some fucking shitty nine to five job for some shitty boss they hate making, you know, minimum wage or something? I mean, good for them. That's legitimately how I feel. Um, I don't think that those type of folks are taking anything away from the other small content creators that I absolutely adore that are making great content and put a lot of effort into their stream and things like that. I think that the Venn diagram the Venn diagram between the people who are watching those type of streams and the people who I think should have much larger viewers. The Venn diagram has two circles, I think. That's my take. What if you had a daughter and she started doing that? Would that bother you as a father? Well, um, if she is of age and that's what she wants to do, then that's that's up to her. That's up to her. Um, that, that would 100% be up to her. I don't... Would, would you, I mean, there's so, there's so many, the question is so loaded, right? Here's the question. Um, if my daughter decided to do that, she was of age, she wasn't being exploited, and that's what she chose to do, I wouldn't have a problem with that. I legitimately wouldn't have a problem with that. Here's what I think. I think that life is too short. I think that life sucks. I think that the cards are stacked against most of us as little people. And I think that people should go out and they should find the happiness that they want. Um, and if, if that is something that makes somebody happy and it keeps them again from working some, some shit tier job for minimum wage, if that's a form of exploitation there, then fuck it. Go do it. Go do it. If I could, if I could, I mean, listen, if there was a job where I could show my feet for two hours a day and make a hundred thousand, two hundred thousand dollars a year versus go work some fucking job I hate, I don't give a fuck. 
I'll show you guys my feet. I don't know. I think we all just have those decisions to make. Might, if it was my daughter, might she regret it? Maybe. Maybe she'll regret it, but am I going to tell her not to? I don't have a moral objection to it. No. As long as you're real about the consequences. Yep, that's exactly right. That's exactly right. I mean, I would be less worried about the moral consequences of my daughter doing that. I would be more worried about the people who might stalk her or make make her unsafe. Like, that would be... The safety would be more of a concern than, let's say, morality. Okay, I, I don't know if I would actually show my feet. My feet aren't really that great, guys. It's just not... gnarly foot fetish <laughs> i don't i actually don't have a foot fetish guys i don't i don't i don't think i have a foot fetish <laughs> prove it pixar it didn't happen <laughs> I, I would never show you guys my feet no way <laughs> well what if i what if i do this what if I had you guys pay me not to see my feet. Maybe that's a new maybe that's a new niche market. Maybe that's a new niche market. I'm not I'm not gonna sell my feet picks. I'm gonna sell my not feet picks. What do you guys think? <laughs> Thank you, Tova. Not Thank feet PLS. Alright. Tova just bought every everybody one month. Wait a minute. Uh, two dollars. Everybody just please don't show. Tova, Tova just bought everybody two days, two days of no no feed picks. Thank you, thank you, Tova. Ah, uh, let's wrap this and grab this. <laughs> Pretty sure that's called it's extortion. Yeah. Oh, uh, you guys want? Oh uh, yeah. If if somebody subs, if somebody subs, we get the foot the foot pick pop up. Please, no feet. Oh, Gracie, thank you. Listen, please, you guys don't have to pay. I'm not going to show you guys my feet. Yeah, 100 bits. It's $1 a day for no feet picks, guys. $1 a day. That's it. You know what I should do? What if I What if I film one of those commercials that's like... Well, I don't really want to... Mm, you know, it's like for $1 a day, we could, we could sponsor somebody you know those commercials that where they're like you know for the for the price of a cup of coffee a day with the sad music in the background where we could like sponsor a pet or an animal but like in this analogy i'm the pet no <laughs> okay <Chris. laughs> i was trying i was trying to find a way tenuous at best to connect these things together but I also feel like there was no good way to do it. Yeah, I'm the pet in this. <laughs> oh, why is this troll here? No, 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 it is. It was more like, you know, for one dollar a day, you, you can sponsor, you can sponsor an entire stream to not have to see feed picks. Okay, I got to skadoosh this guy. Hold up. Hold up, I'm gonna I'm gonna doink this guy. Uh there is enemy variety, it's just I've been in the same biome for a long time. There we go. There's that yeah, as you change biomes, like when you get to the swamp, there'll be a different set of enemies. Oh god, I don't wanna get hit again. So in this game, you kind of progress through a set of okay, listen, I'm gonna pop this now before I die. You pr kind of progress through a set of biomes, and there is, whoops, generally a different set of mobs in every biome. Like the meadows, the meadows in the black forest has a little bit of overlap, and then you get into the swamp. The swamp kind of mostly has its own set of things. And then the mountains has its own set of things, etc. cetera. Oh, uh, I'm gonna, wait. 
Did I just accidentally the meadows? No, wait a goddamn second. There's no way there is... There's no way there's meadows in my backyard. We were just saying earlier we had to go search of meadows. What? Okay. Yo, this seed be wilded out. Nah. No, I'm happy. Wait a minute. Is this actually a big... Wait a minute. Am I confused? There, there's no way this Meadows has just been here. Oh, my God. You never had... You never had your car. Oh. Oh, I'm getting chased by 100 dudes right now. I'm the king of this hill. I'm the king of this hill, losers. Hey. But I need everybody to stand on the hill so I can actually hit them with this. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I, I had no idea. Also, I need to kill that boar. I need two boars so I can make the uh, the axe. My guy. I think this is probably why I excel okay. at adventure games and you guys don't. Listen. Okay. This is good. I need to kill two boars. But I can't get lost. I, there's no way this is here. Guys. We ran around this map for hours last night. Hold on. No, no, no. Rainbow. We did not. I never left the... Oh, look at this. Here we go, baby. That's my... Uh, that's my scraps I need for my axe. Yo, we about to pop off. I did not... I was not here last night, guys. No way. There's no way I was here last night. This, this, I can see my house from right here. Wait. Am I lost? Uh. Oh no. Okay, I should be up this coast. I should just be up this coast. No, no, no. Guess we did not run that far. You might not like it, but this is what peak recon looks like. Oh my God, there's another troll. Where's Grimhawk? Grimhawk, eat my ass. There's another troll right here. Okay, remember yesterday when you were like, oh, uh, yesterday you were like, oh, that's the same troll. Guess what? Guess what? Tis not, there was two trolls, my friend. Is this guy okay up there? Sir? I want him to come down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. I have an idea. I want that troll. Okay, everybody, please come here for a second. I would like to have... We're going to have our morning meeting right here. There we go. Make sure we're fooded up. Can't tell if this guy... Oh, my God. Okay, that guy is, I thought, I thought that he was half dead. I still have my Ektir buff here for a Uno Momento. Nice try, nice try, big man. Okay, I'm gonna kite back where I think my house is. Hold on, here we go. Hey, heads up, Skelly! Wait, I need that deer hide right there. Oh, nice try, bud. How does the kid do it? My house should be... Guys, if we lose the house... If we lose the house... There's no way. Hold on. I need a... I'm gonna give this guy full tuggers right now. Full tuggers right in the head. Oh boy, that was not his head. All right, I'm kiting. I'm kiting towards the house. Kiting towards the house. I need the money off this guy, so we can buy the bajangalang. Also, I'm gonna sneak up on this deer. Okay, maybe not. Also, hey, hey, there we go. We got the deer. Skeleton, skeletons, please assist me. I feel like a necromancer. 
controlling controlling the will. Uh oh. Uh. Oh, I think we can find plenty of those. I need all this money. Shit. What do I drop? I don't need that head. I don't need that head. Nice job, Skellies. Hey, listen, we're all in this together, guys. We're all in this together here in the forest. Is there a log in this one? Okay. My house better be right up here. Okay. I kited up this hill. Let me get these. Let me get these boo berries. There we go. Oh, my house is right here. I found it, guys. I think I... Yeah, we didn't lose the house. We didn't lose the house. But we did some good scouting. We did... Also, I think we can probably go make our bronze... Our bronze X. So we can get rid of this uh, shit tier stone X that I have. Uh, let's drop everything in there. Okay, let's go. This guy followed me home. All right, let's get it. Let's get it going. Let's get it going. All right, there we go. Do we not have wood? Okay, wood is a bit of a problem. Let's go ahead and drop that in there. Okay. I should have everything I need to go ahead and make my... Okay. But why not, though? Oh, because I need four wood. Okay. What state am I from? From the great state of Vermont. I'm a Vermonter. Originally. And I'm in the Northeast at the moment. There we go. The state, I'm state of lost. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm originally from Vermont. I currently live, we'll say in the greater, in the greater Boston area. State of delusion. Okay, team. Okay. Bronze X coming up. And let's see how, oh shit, guys. We're popping off. Oh my God. Okay, I just learned that I can, wait, I can get a rested buff from my forge. What? Let's go. Look at this. Ah, uh, Elden Ring. Let me tell... <laughs> All right, everybody brace yourself for Elden Ring story. Okay, we got to go through the whole thing here. I fell in love with Souls games in Bloodborne. I loved Bloodborne so much that I, um, I platinumed Bloodborne, and then I played Dark Souls 3, and I loved Dark Souls 3 so much that I platinumed Dark Souls 3. And then Elden Ring came out. The problem I have with Elden Ring... I, I want to do Elden Ring at some point, but I've tried to play Elden Ring like four times, but I can't get, I can't find like a bit, like I've played the first four hours of Elden Ring like eight times. Um, One of these days, we just have to do it. We just have, we just have to do it. We, we're going to sit like take maybe like four or five streams, like just like a week and we're just going to do, we're just going to do it guys. We can't keep talking about it. We can't keep talking about it. Okay. I need I, I need to be the Elden Lord that we know I can be. Nothing is quite as restful and relaxing as working at a forge. <laughs> yes, sure, big true. Yeah, we're going to, it's just like, I don't know. Every time it comes up, everybody kind of groans, but it's like a personal, it's a personal, it's, this is personal to me that i i think it is a phenomenal game i think it deserves all the accolades it gets i love FromSoft's games and i actually feel bad that i just haven't haven't beaten it uh let's also put that in there okay we're looking good let's all right everything is loaded let's go let's sleep let's sleep the, the smelt away there we go 
Probably says dodge, dodge, strike, dodge. I know, but like, like the. Am I sleeping or what's happening? Hold on, everybody. Are we okay? Close this. There we go. We'll be before Dark Souls 4, Elden Ring 2. Okay. Okay. Bloodborne is an amazing game. Oh, I'm out of wood. Bloodborne is like a really phenomenal game. All right, let's drop all of this off. So yeah, anyway, I'm sh I'm sure we'll see a Bloodborne playthrough soon enough, but I'm really kind of I'm really kind of enjoying the survival crafting games. At the moment, what else do we have here? Um Let's grab this and all of that is good. Okay. Looking good. I didn't get wood. Yo, let's go try this new axe out. I'm about to fell some trees. I couldn't get into Sekiro. Sekiro was too different. The, like, again, Sekiro is a game where I, I get why people love it. But I, cu I couldn't get into the combat in Sekiro, and I probably didn't give it enough of a try, but I also don't... I, I think that it's different enough from the Souls games that I enjoy that I'm not certain that I'm going to go back to it. Yeah, I own it. I tried it. I just... I didn't love the combat as much as I did in Bloodborne in Dark Souls 3. And the combat in Dark... In, the combat in Bloodborne is, is better than the combat in Dark Souls 3, in my opinion. Dark Souls 3 this feels really... It felt really sluggish. Also, Bloodborne is the game that ruined Witcher 3 for me. Because after I beat Bloodborne, I tried Witcher 3 and the combat just felt terrible. But I, I didn't what I didn't realize is that the Bloodborne combat makes every game combat feel terrible. Yeah, it was my most game played, most played game for a long time. It like maybe nine hundred hours in Bloodborne. I fucking loved it. We used to do uh, PvP fight clubs where, it, like, there was a group that ran it, and they would get a dungeon. They would have like a dungeon location every Saturday morning for like four hours. There was a PvP fight club, and everybody would show up and just like you know click click the thing, go into the dungeon, and it was like a rule set. It was so much fun. That shit was so much fun because people would just show up with wacky fucking builds. And I know Elden Ring has like a little bit of that in PvP, but that's the only thing that I really miss. Uh, the, the only thing I really wanted to do in Elden Ring was, well, A, I, a, I want to beat it and play it, but B, I just want to make like wacky PvP builds. I, I miss that period of, of gaming uh, where I could, I felt like I had the time to kind of experiment and just screw around with that type of stuff. Yeah, those was good times. Very good times. Uh, all right, we got them carrots right now. Let's go. Let's get this re. Let's get this redone here. Uh, we're gonna replant. Wait, how many seeds do I have? Thirty seeds. Um, let's just go ahead and replant this. I want to make sure. I make sure we have enough seeds. Looking good, looking good. We're gonna need a we're gonna need a way bigger garden, guys. But keep in mind, this is just uh, for us to make our gear. I'm gonna be honest with you. I think we can make a shitload of iron gear right now. We're gonna be we're gonna have to hunt deer, which uh, seem to be everywhere out there. What we? Oh, okay. I fell off my base. All right, here we go. I'm up here. I have eight carrots left. Well, we shouldn't have to. Like, we still can't make carrot food just yet. Iron? Uh, mm, not... Okay, not yet on the iron gray. Settle. Mother fluffer. I just went out and... Okay, I don't want to... I don't want to talk about it. Let me just come out and grab this. Let me just come out and grab some wood here. You know what I mean, gray. You know what I mean. Let me grab this here. 
We're close to iron. Okay, we're close to iron. We're one boss kill away from iron. And then we're going to pop off. I promised you guys that I would have a full set of T4 bronze gear by the end of today's stream. And I've got three and a half hours. I've got three and a half hours. And you know what? If I don't make it then, I'll call my four-year-old and be like, listen, son. I can't spend time with you today because I made a promise to some very important people that I would acquire a thing in a virtual realm. And I know you're sad, but this is the reality of life. What do you guys think? Daddy's busy. Daddy's busy farming virtual items, son. One day you'll understand. One day you'll understand. Firm affair. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no, I will not go over well. I would, not. I would never do that. I would never do that. All right. What did I need? Okay, we got this. Do I have anything sexy we can make yet? Ooh, I can make one carrot soup. All right, we're going to be... Uh, this is what I need. Oh, God. I need everything. You'll unsub for my, my OnlyFans V fix? No. No trampolines today, Squirt. Daddy's farming virtual items in a completely made up world. Yes. All right. I need. I need. I need. I need to make some arrows. We have to go hunting. While this is working, we got to go do some hunting, team. Big hunting energy. Wait, the promise? That's not me promising that I would... Please tell me, Allie. Wait a minute. That's not me promising... Was that today or yesterday? Because yesterday, I made, I might have made some promises that I didn't fulfill. I might have. I have to make some arrows. Oh, that was today? Oh, no. Uh, The only thing that I need is... I need deer. I need to kill some deer and then wear their skins. Oh my god. I shot that that deer was gonna be an adventurer. And then he took an arrow and oh my god. Let's go, baby. If I can get the deer, I can if I can get the deer skin, we can make it. I think we actually have enough bronze. Keep barking for me, deer. Let's not get lost. Okay, my back is to the base. Okay, so all we have to do to get home is turn around. That's right. Then we took an arrow. That deer took it. I actually did shoot that. Uh oh, this one's on the run. Here it comes. Uh oh. Oh god. To the ends of the earth. Uh oh. I'm a believer. Yo, Skyrim, I could not get into either. Skyrim, Skyrim is a game I can't get into. Like, man, I I wish I could get into Skyrim. Oh, that stump jumped in the way. There it is. Boop, got it. First try, baby. First try. Yeah, I always want to play like as a caster because I think if I remember correctly, like in the first couple of hours, you get to go to some college of magic people, and that always intrigued me, so I wanted to be a caster, but then I think I spent like four hours running around holding my hand out in front of me, spewing flames, and that was like the that was the extent of my combat <clears throat> in uh in Skyrim. Like, it's not like when I used to play Morrowind and I invented Frostfire. Like that that was that was good shit right there. Yeah, I played Morrowind back in the day, Toki. I don't know if you heard the story about how I invented Frostfire in Morrowind, but I did. I hear another deer. Squawk for me, deer. I see you, baby. Okay, that's bullshit. I was shooting downhill. Oh, I killed one. There was two of them. They were they were hiding in single file to, to hide their numbers. Hold on. That's an easy kill. That one. Please. I need to wear your skin. I'm almost out of arrows. 
Uh, I never really played GTA 5, so I'm not sure about GTA 6. Maybe. I, I don't know. I don't I don't know if it's my thing. I, I know this sounds cringe, but, like, I have an extreme... I have a, I have a real respect for, the, for some of the people who do, uh, like... Oh, I'm going to drown if I go in there. Hold on, hold on. Like, I would love to do roleplay because I just like to fuck around and, like, be a character and make shit up. But, like, I never really played GTA V, so I don't know. Maybe I missed maybe I missed my opportunity to be in the Cool Kids Roleplay Club in the GTAs. Ah, uh, let's see. There's a ton of copper down here. I feel like this is not as hard as we're making it. This is not as hard as we're making it. Red Dead, I, I would actually love to try something like that, whether it be Red Dead or GTA. Half of them never played the game. Yeah, but like, I don't understand like the mechanics. Like, oh, come on, dear. Son of a biscuit. Look, I told you. I told you guys I knew where the vendor was. I don't know why you guys don't believe me. Vendor is right here. With Chaos Mod. I mean, I wouldn't be opposed. I wouldn't. Oh, shit. I wouldn't be opposed to doing mods for a Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough since, like, I beat it. I don't know what the Chaos mod is, but I, I actually wouldn't hate that. I do, I think, um, I enjoy a lot of GTA RP. I'm, I'm not, like, super in love with some of the... I feel, I feel like there is an unhealthy element to some of, we'll call it, like the culture around gta streamers and things that i don't particularly love but i feel like there are a handful of gta 5 rp streamers that are like very talented very funny from like an improv an improv and character perspective i it's to me i think it's like an underrated form of of comedy that a lot of them do Uh, I don't mean by those people. I mean, if you follow... And, I, and I'm not uh, superior to complex. Well, some some of that. But I would say there's a lot of drama. And I, I don't really follow it as well as I should. So I probably shouldn't even comment on it. But there's like a lot of drama around the people who run those servers. And how they're moderated. And who gets in and who doesn't. And like, all, there's there's just like a lot of weird shit that happens behind the scenes in some of those communities. I mean, probably any community. But... All right, we do not. I'm going to put this in here. <laughs> Foot stuff. Why you guys all, you guys are always talking about feed. Are you guys okay out there? All right. So, wow, I can already bronze up some more. Yo, let's go. All right, I need, let's just start making this. We're going to make the cuirass. We're going to make the leggings. We're going to make the helmet. Okay. The only thing that is... Okay. Actually, hold on. The pants are A armor. My current pants are four. Okay. That's a pretty significant... I'm going to break my... I'm going to break my policy right now. I'm going to put the bronze on. Yo, we bronzed out, baby. We bronzed out right now. Okay. So. Honestly, the thing that's holding me back the most right now is going to be the deer hide. Uh, can I make... Oh, bronze head arrows. Jeez. Let me see how much flint I have. I really... I mean, I guess we can use our bronze for bronze head arrows. Let's grab this and this. Bring it up here and pop that in in there okay uh 25 wood let's grab this gather <clears throat> gather let's gather a little bit more wood real quick and i'm gonna pop off like 100 arrows and we're gonna go do some hunting i need to kill boar i need to kill deer
Yeah, you just rock that diamond tip game. All right, we should be should be in pretty good shape here. When those carrots are ready, like we're we're gonna be we're gonna pop off when those carrots are ready. Okay, just so everybody knows the score, the carrot score. We're gonna actually pop off on that. All right, I'm gonna waste some bronze. But the difference goes from 27 pierce, okay, to 32. That wasn't, <clears throat> that might have actually been a waste. Not a good waste, like a bad waste. Um, all right, I'm going to come down here. We'll put my bro gear. I don't think we're going to need to be doing any bros today, but mayhaps. Okay, 5 out of 10 wood. I need a little bit more wood. We're in bronze gear now. <clears throat> We're pretty thick. Wow, that's a lot of core wood. Uh, we probably should just go ahead and burn this core wood. Uh, <clears throat> I did try Pal World. I actually would like to do a full playthrough of Pal World, like to end game, but I, I just don't know if it's in the cards just due to time. And also everybody will hate watching it. Those, those two things conspire against me sometime. Um, I would, I would like to, I, I got to like level 15 or something. I think I have a couple of hours in it. I did some building. It's just one of those games where for some reason I feel compelled to keep going. Like there was a thing there. There were things about it that I didn't love, but there were things about it that kept me like that have kept me wanting to go back and make sure that I've tried it enough. I'm like, I'm like pal world curious really is what it comes down to. I'm pal world curious. Okay, I'm not allergic to endgames. My guy, I literally was about to kill the queen. I literally was about to kill the queen. We had a Pal World server. Uh, nobody was playing it. The Pal World server actually became the uh, Valheim server. We have a we have a Valheim server compliments of the Pal World server. Everybody kind of faded off into into other things, which is fine. That's why we just rotate. You know, we just rotate the servers. We'll be. Thank you, Lizzie. Thank you. We will be back in Miss Lands in no time. Okay. L uh, let's make sure that we. Okay, we're good. Let's go ahead and sleep if we can. It did, it did actually self-delete. Yeah, Grim, that's that's a good point. I think an update... I think an update got pushed, and it just, like, nuked the Power World server. Somebody logged in one day, they were like, everything is gone. So, yeah. Thank you, Cathodic. We're getting there. We're getting there. Also, Pomelo, of course. Of course I'm in Bronze Gear. Honestly, the only thing that's holding me back from T4 Bronze Gear right now is going to be Deer, which we're going to hunt. So, we're going to tr we're gonna transition into a bit of a hunting stream uh, here. I've got some bronze tipped arrows and don't need this. Don't need this. Everything else is mostly repaired. Let's go take a look at, uh, actually, I kind of need to farm thistle because I think we can start making, uh, wait, do we have access to the fermenter right now? I don't. Okay. Okay, first of all, the hunting in CK3 was a lot of fun, okay? That shit was a lot of fun. The only thing holding me back is chat, as always. I've just got... I'm trying to carry chat through this game, kicking and screaming. Okay. This, got him. First try, baby. Let's go. I think I'm going to need like 30, 30 deer hides. We got our rested buff. We're fully kind of fooded up. We should, guys, we should have made that one carrot soup. Okay, keep in mind, we're running into the sunrise. We should just stick to the coasts, but. The coast is not where the meadows. The, if I remember correctly. The Meadows... Wait. I thought the Meadows was right here. 
Now, wait a goddamn second. No, the meadows must have been up here. Where are all them deer at? Okay, this ocean is where I thought the meadows was? That can't be right. No, no, no. Meadows is back. Meadows is back this way. Meadows is back this way. Uh, ish. Okay, this actually doesn't make sense. I literally kited that troll this way. Hmm. This, the math ain't mathin', guys. All right, well, we got plenty of blueberries. I really need some strawberries. That's what I'm missing. Okay, the meadows is probably, uh, it's gotta be over here. This is... That's my house! <laughs> Alright, let's check over here. My house... My house is right there. Let's go this way. We're not lost. I know where my house is. Okay, this looks like it's the... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I told you guys it was right over here. I don't think it's a big meadows, though. Here we go. All right, beautiful. All right, everybody, keep your eye out for deer. I'm going to give this one a little wacky whack all the way downtown. Oh, my God. My guy. Dude messing his life up. Yeah, I started drawing my map last night, but I also think that I might have... I think that my map might have gotten me a little lost yesterday. The problem the problem that I have with maps is that if you don't draw them accurately, your map can get you lost. Yeah, did you see that, Cathonic? Thank you for your follow. Hey, Crimer, thank you. I don't even know... Oh, there it is. I found it. Never mind. Everybody can stop looking for it. Here's my question. Here's my question. How far? Maybe it's better if I don't ask. Let's go up here. Also, is it like the amount that we know about the game for okay. sure right now is not commensurate with the array of things that we've learned that we don't know about. Okay, listen. Oh, T4 gear ink, baby. Boop. Yo, we gonna have some Queen's Jammy Jam coming up right now. We're gonna be cooking. We're gonna be eating. Things are gonna be good. Also, we should get... Where'd that deer go? Oh, here it is. We should try to get some flint. Uh, maybe we go down the coast. We go down the shore. Uh, have we made any progress on the search? Well, I know where the boss isn't, Lizzie. I don't know if that's a helpful answer or not. I know where the boss isn't. Hold on. How many do I need for the thing? Holy tits. 15. Okay. Not a problemo. Not a problemo. Let's go ahead and snatch it up. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You might not like it, but this is what peak recon looks like. Uh, also, do you know what we haven't done yet? You know what would make a life a lot easier? If I whack this tree down and it, and we can build boats now. We can get our own boaty boat to do a little sailing. I honestly think we'll get lost less with a boat. I think we'll get lost less with a boat. I haven't gotten any fine wood yet. I think when I loot this, 
we should be able to i'm gonna loot this fine wood and it's gonna open up the ability for us to build a fine wood bow okay forge cooler an ad z come on boat where's my boat portals good table build pieces the carve guys we can now build the carve hell yes my brothers and sisters we have we have done it and the fermenter beautiful i need the fermenter guys also, it's about to be nighttime. Thank you, Lizzie. Some people, some people don't appreciate my navigational skills. Some people aren't believers like you. We definitely have to get a fermenter, like blasting, for them healy potions, stamina potions. Okay. Uh, how many deer, how many deer skins? God damn it. I only have five. I heard number six and seven right up here. I heard, I heard you bark again, deer bark. I dare you. I, oh, it's a double deer. It's a double deer barking. Yes. I, sh I had to shoot him in the foot. Only when you navigate by th that's okay. That's true. Well, yeah, I, I, that's what I, I have to navigate by feel sometimes, but I, I have to navigate with my heart. Um, yeah, I navigate with my heart. You know, that saying It's that saying that is, I do not navigate with my compass. I navigate with my heart. Those who navigate with their compass have forgotten the face of their father. Okay? Uh, wise man once said that. I hear them deer barking out here. I'm not making a compass, guys. Like, I don't know. Maybe, maybe the navigational table. Every time I bring up the navigational table, Gray yells at me and tells me that I don't need it. Okay, well, we've cleared the way to kill this boar now. Okay, we're wasting all my arrows. I can just run up and stab it. Uh, I can make a sundial. I can show you guys. I can show you guys how to make a sundial. Okay, we should be edging back into the BF right now. Oh, uh, wait a minute. How much, what do we need for a fermenter? Fermenter is five prawns, some resin... We probably could get two fermenter redos up if we got a little aggressive right now. Yo, I wish that I was memeing, Grim. I, I wish... That's a good example of where I wish that I was memeing and was, like, actually... Actually fucking around. For the sake of content. But... That, that clip is actually funny. Okay, now we have to remember how to get home. This is our Black Forest right here. If I remember correctly, we have to run this direction. Back to my house. I think. Okay. Guys, if we lose my house, I'm going to be so sad. I think we are. Okay. We might have to take the time to build a path. If I can get some carrot food, I think we can we can probably Are you chitting me right now? Are you chitting me? Look what the Look, it's literally in a river. What's this thing doing? It's just sitting there. No way. Yo, there's a big banana mountain over there. My innate ability, I, I know. It's like the word. Yeah, but it, it there's... Here's the thing, though, Grim. For every one of those clips where I accidentally produce great content because of my laziness and stupidity, you know what I mean? Like, I have to deal with a lifetime of just being terrible at video games, right? When you think about... It is a big river. I mean, look, you can see both sides here. You know, I, I have to live a lifetime of being terrible at games 
I have to possess like this weird. I have to possess this weird cross section of ignorance, laziness, and stubbornness. A hundred percent of my life to produce one. We have to distill that down to produce one clip like that, like every four hours, right? Uh, no, in fact, well, we can see other biomes, so I'll, sh I'll show you. If you come down here, you can see, you can see the other, you can see two more biomes from here. So if you look across, we're, we're in the black forest. We were just in a, we were just in what's called a meadows where I got those white birch trees. Um, if you look across here, see those spooky trees up there. If you see those spooky trees, you know that that is going to be swamp over there. These are swamp trees, so that's a swamp biome. And then if you see these mountains, like, they're not fully rendered because they're so far, but mountains that high are going to be a mountain biome. If we were to if we were to swim across here, we would enter the swamp biome, and the ground would actually be brown, and there would be swamp monsters in there. And then if we ran up here, this would be a snow biome up there. Um, so we can actually probably see three biomes there. So those trees right there are probably black forest trees, I'm guessing. So we probably have a little bit of black forest there. We definitely have swamp here, and we definitely have mountains up there. So you can go to any biome anytime you want, but there is a progression from a gear standpoint where you kind of start with the leather gear in the meadows, which is what I just got out of. Once you go into the, the gameplay loop is you enter a biome, you search the biome and you find the resources that you need to unlock things that you can make and create. So the first biome, you're going to be wearing rag gear that you make from leather scraps. You're going to be wearing leather gear that you make from deer hide. The second biome is where we start making bronze, which is what we're actually smelting back at our camp. And then we... Okay, hold on. Um, so you start making bronze and we kind of like find all the copper we find all the tin we smelt it all up we turn it into bronze gear then we go to the once we kill the second boss it gives us an item that we need to be able to access iron in the swamp so we'll go to the swamp and we'll do the same thing we'll do the exact same thing we will we will we will farm the iron i could stab this guy but why 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 um so we'll go to the we'll get that item We'll go to the swamp, and we will farm the swamp stuff. There's wood in the swamp that unlocks things. There's um, there's animal parts that unlock different things. And then we will find some catacombs, and we will farm the iron, and we will make an iron set of gear. Once the iron set of gear is done, we'll kill the boss in the swamp, and that will uh, allow us to kind of move into the mountains. And then we will farm the mountains for silver and the animal parts that we gather up there, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So the gameplay loop is very much move into a new biome. Now the thing the the thing is from a strategy perspective, especially no map, no portal, is not all biomes are created equal. Like we looked across there and we're like, okay, that's probably swamp. Well. It doesn't mean that that swamp is going to be large enough for us to go to and reasonably farm. So a lot of it is like kind of scouting. Is this a big enough swamp to have enough things in it that we can extract to actually fully upgrade our gear? Or is this like a tiny little sliver biome? So this is a really big black forest that we're in now. We can see copper right here if we run over here. This is a copper deposit. This is the stuff that we're farming. Um, so the reason why I put my base right there is because we basically had one, two, three, four... I think we had like five copper nodes in within range of my base, which means that I can farm them quickly. I can get them back... Oh, this one here. Farm them quickly, get them back to my base, get them smelted up, and then upgrade my gear. Our next step will be to kill the boss of this biome. But we have to find the boss. I have no idea where the boss is. In a non... In a non no map In a regular game you would find clues in a in, in the boss would get marked on your map and then you could just f go to the boss and kill it but we're doing a no map no portal which means i literally have to stumble across the summoning location for the boss like i have to search the entire map and the way that the biomes are kind of like uh, uh they're um gened you know, procedurally with some rules but I could spend a week just sailing around the map trying to find the boss summon location. It could, I, it, I could have already run by it in the dark. Like it, it, it's like not guaranteed that we're gonna be able to find it. This guy better not be faffoing. Or you could run around naked and die a lot. Done. I didn't say anything that was wrong, Ray. Okay, nice try. 
Nice try, but nice try, Buckaroo. They are adding some more content soon. Yeah, they're adding a new. I think they. Uh, you guys can correct me on this, but I think they're adding. Maybe they have two new biomes. Like one is one biome is coming this year. What are we just farming? I think that one new biome is coming this year. Ah, uh, let's see. Yep. Yep, Ashlands, and then if I remember correctly, somebody said maybe a rework of the ocean somehow, but I don't know. All right, let's drop some stuff off. Let's cook some stuff. Um, okay, we now have 13 of these. Okay, let's go see. We should be able to get our upgrade to T2. We're going to be close. We're going to be close. All right, let's get upgraded. Oh my God, there's no way. There's no way the... I don't want to talk about it. We didn't actually need to go farm those. It's only bronze. Okay, so I need a T3 bench, which we should be able to craft very easily. T3 bench. Let's go ahead and drop this. Oh my god. T4 bench. We also Wait, I Is that that's the anvils. Wait, that's the anvils. That's the forge cooler. That's the Okay. My gear is at T3. Let's go ahead and upgrade the pickaxe. Do we really want to spend our bronze? Uh, yeah, we probably should upgrade this. Okay. We're in full T3. I don't think I can get T4. What? I don't... I don't think I can get this station to T4 with what we have. Okay. All right. Well, this is good. I mean, we're at T3. We're at 37 armor. We are just going to continue to upgrade. We need to make our fermenters. We got to get our fermenters. Where are those going to go? God. Uh, what's the highest level of armor and weapons? Yeah, don't, don't anybody answer that because I... All I know about is Ashlands, is the Ashland stuff. I don't want anybody to tip it, tip off anything that I might have that I might have missed. Um okay, I need This is going to be like our front door. Yeah, if somebody wants to DM you, that's cool. We're just trying to do this as uh it's no hint, no tip is possible. Each set goes to four at most. Yeah, for the armor that I've seen so far. So either I haven't unlocked a, a workbench thing yet, or I can't get this to four. I mean, I, I, I'm i guessing I have to unlock something. We also did not get enough strawberries for the jam, I don't think. Let's go take a look here. What's my best food that I can make? This carrot soup. I'm about to pop off on carrot soup, though. All right, let's make this. I think that's the best we're going to be able to do right now. Let's place those. Let's place this. What am I missing? I'm missing two, two strawberries. I don't have any necks. We could actually make this deer stew with a couple of cooked boar meats. Mother fluffer. My base isn't big enough. I actually need like, can I put an addition? I could blow this. I could blow this wall out a little bit if I really wanted and put another, another cooking place right here. But <clears throat> who's got time for that? Wait, 
I could be lazy and just put it outside. All right, let's forget about it for right now. What's the priority right now? I think that our armor is as high as we can get it. Oh, the bow. We have to make a bow for the boss. I'm going to need... I'm going to need a fine wood bow. Which I'm guessing I don't make here. We're going to have to upgrade this. Fine wood bow. 32 pierce versus 22. Significant upgrade. I need fine wood, core, and deer hide. Wait, didn't I just have a bunch of fine wood? Okay, we can grab... A bunch of fine wood. Do I swear I just had fine wood. Carrot seeds. I need those carrot seeds. Oh, shit. Grab this. Grab this. Okay, I guess we have to go back. I don't know if I need to keep that or not. All right, we got to go back and get fine wood. Let's get our... I mean, honestly... I guess we could probably put our fermenters in here. Okay, this is what we got to do. I, I have to focus. I have to focus for a second. Everybody, just relax. Oh, God. I de Okay, we're going to go get a bunch of fine wood because we need to make our bow and we need to get a couple of fermenters going. I mean, this boss is stupid easy to beat. I just want to make sure that we, we have everything, like, the best we can get it in case we don't find our way back. I guess maybe, I guess maybe that's what I'm trying to say. Okay, I think the meadows were this way. Let's see whether I'm right or wrong. Okay, team? I think that I'm about to amaze all of you with my sick navigational... Look, I think I see Meadows Trees all the way back there. Yo, there is so much copper here, though. Yeah, we could, we could go nutty on some more copper for a while. Any reason I don't do cam? Yeah, first of all, I'm very self-conscious. I hate how I look. Um, I hate seeing myself in my videos. Like, I, I had cam on for a while. I just hate it. Um, I think beyond that, I hate, like, the lighting. I'm literally, like, staring into two lights. It's, like, a green screen. It just takes up space. Like, there's just a hundred reasons why I hate the cam. Like, any viewership loss that I would lose because I don't have a cam, I literally don't care about. I, I, I don't mean that, like, if somebody wants to watch a viewer that has a camera on, I support them. Go do it. But, you know... For everybody, for every single person on Reddit that's like, wow, you need to have a camera if you want to grow. Like, if somebody's not going to watch the stream because I don't have my camera on, well, A, I don't know it. So it's just so inconsequential to me, but I also just don't care, right? If it's, if that's 10 average viewers or 20 average viewers, like, it just does not matter to me. I would rather, I would rather sit here in the dark in my sleeveless shirt looking like a fucking trash goblin then have a camera on me for like 15 hours a day or 14, 12, 8 hours a day. 100%, yeah. What are we looking for? Oh, I need uh, fine wood. How much fine wood have we already run past? There we go. Nah, I'm not... I could, I just couldn't. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there, I don't think there's ever a chance. Again, you know, look, VTubing is a thing. I 1000% anybody uh, representing themselves online and, and creating content the way they want. I 1000% support VTubers. I 1000% do. I don't necessarily think that's... It's it's not how I want to represent myself online. Yeah, I mean, here's the thing. Just because it's not for me doesn't, you know... I have nothing against it, right? Like, I support them. I support VTubers a thousand percent. It's just not for me. It's just one of those things, you know? Cam haters? Wait, is that a, is that a thing? 
Oh, you're saying gaining gaining people who would prefer not to have the cam on stream. Yeah, I got it, got it, got it. Maybe, maybe. I mean, it's one of the reasons why I like, but it's a lot of, it's like, it's clutter. It like, it's like, then I got to figure like every game I play, like where's the camera going to go? I mean, I think any reason's a good reason to VTube if that's, again, I support people creating the content they want to create and representing themselves online however they like. I just think that there are things, there are things that are for me and there are things that are not. So, I mean, that's just that's how I look at it. Yeah. Is that why you like my BRB screen, Grim? Listen, I finally took January's schedule off the BRB screen for you guys, okay? Because I love you guys. And that's... that. Listen, that's the distance I'm willing to go for you guys. Is to remove my January schedule off my BRB screen. Your product as is works well. I... Well, thank you for that. Thank you. I don't know. I'm the world's laziest streamer and content creator. Like, that's... That's it. Like... I'm just going to take the path of path of least resistance. If it doesn't if it doesn't work, if it's not good, then that's my fault. But I've also kind of been learning to trust my instincts a little more than conventional wisdom because I think a lot of conventional wisdom is kind of shitty. Yeah, if somebody, well, here here's what I'm saying. Again, I don't mean to sound dismissive of people who enjoy cams. Like, if you enjoy a cam and you find it more more interactive, again, I 1,000% support anybody who says... I support the people who say, I don't want to watch your stream because you don't have a camera. I support that. I'm not being flippant by saying, go find what you like on Twitch. I'm just saying, this might not be for you, you know? Um, but if you like that type of thing, I get it. I get why people do like it. There are streamers that I watch that I do like to have it on because, you know, reactions and engagement and interactivity and all of that stuff. Yeah, it's just, it's just not for me. I'm just out here getting this, uh, getting wood in the rain here. <laughs> Thank you, Doc. Yeah, there's clips out there. There's clips out there. But I just enjoy it more. I just enjoy what I'm doing right now. That's all I want to do. Here's my problem. All I want to do is what I love doing. That's it. That's all I want to do. And one of the things I love is not having, not having a camera on me for like 10 hours a day, yeah. Oh, uh, turn it off because, uh, oh, because he got an injury? Yeah. Well, what ended up happening, I went cam on when I first went, well, like, when my first break from RimWorld, when I went variety, I went cam on because that's, like, conventional wisdom. Conventional wisdom is, you know, if you want to grow, you got to turn your camera on. And I was like, well, I'm trying to be a full-time streamer and I'm going to have to make some sacrifices and do some things that I don't want to do. And this is probably one of those things that I will need if I actually want to build a viewership high enough to be able to sustain myself doing this. Then I kind of got burnt out on it. I just kind of got tired and then I got sick. I got sick for like a week, like real sick. Like my voice, like you could hear it uh, in my voice, like super sick. And I just was like, I'm not staring into these lights while I'm sick and while I'm streaming, I'm just going to turn it off. And then I just realized how much I love having the lights off and the cam it just never came back on. I was just like, you know what? I don't care. If people are not going to watch because this, the cam isn't on, that's fine. My enjoyment in streaming uh, without the cam is just way too high. We just chop it in the rain. Rest buff, one minute, baby. But we got a ton of, like, fine wood, though. Oh, five kids? I'm a single dad of one child. I don't know how anybody does more than one kid. I wouldn't. I would not survive. I love my son to death, but it's like, even on the amazing days, I'm still so tired. I can't, like, I just can't imagine. I don't know how people do it. Even on good mornings where there's no argument about going to school and getting his shoes on and getting dressed, I'm still tired by the time I get into school. I can't imagine doing that for like five kids. I would just die. I would probably just die. 
So I have I have mad respect. I have mad respect for all parents. Well, I should say all parents that are making a good faith effort to raise their children in the healthiest way they possibly can. Um, but yeah, tremendous amount of work. Oh, past college? I mean, yeah, but still, right? Like how much how much time and effort it must have still taken in those days when the kids were younger. How how would I have made it? I, mean, I, I wouldn't have Yosemite. I don't know. I think there... Wait a minute. I think there is an element of... You know, I worked with a co-worker who had six kids. And when my son was... Before my son was born, I asked her, like, how do you survive? And she was like, you, just, you don't have a choice. Like, you get up and you make six sandwiches for breakfast. And, you know, you make six lunches. And, you know, she's like... You do it because you don't have a choice and you don't know anything different. And I was like, what's well, fucking good answer right there? Oh, God. Wait, where the fuck am I? Uh-oh. This does not look familiar. I don't remember a spawner being there. Uh-oh, I might have gotten turned around, guys. Hold up. Uh, I mean, you can say that she, d d you can say that she did have a choice. Her her point is, okay. I, I don't, I don't, I don't. I'm not necessarily convinced that's a good faith uh, like argument, right? Her point is, when you have six kids, you can't just say that you're not gonna make them lunch or you're not gonna make them breakfast, right? Like, if we if we want to if we want to roll back that argument all the way to the beginning of time, I think that's kind of an unfair charge to levy. But, Goldie, good morning. Guys, I thought my base. I might have. Am I lost? Guys, none of this looks familiar. Wait a minute. My base should have been right up here. Oh, God. I don't remember these spawners. I wonder if I'm a natural at this game. Oof. Right. I, I think that I... I think that I agree with that sentiment, yes. Um. Oh boy. Guys, I have no idea where I am. I've got bad news. I think if I follow this coast, we get back to the base, but none of this looks, none of this looks familiar. Hold on. Oh God. Oh God. Am I making it worse right now? I might be. There's no way I don't follow this and get home. Right? Oh. Oh, God. We're back in the meadows. We're back in the meadows. All right, I've got good news. I need to kill some necks. Oh boy.
Okay. Okay. Well, this is good. This is good. This is actually good news for us. This is good news for us. This is good news for us. Okay? Because I know how to get home from the meadows. This time. Oh, good. Good, good, good. If we hadn't taken this route, we wouldn't have found these strawberries. We need a base on the other side of the island. Oh. Guys, I'm wet. No rested buff. There is a lot of mystery and strawberries happening. Okay. Here's my take. We should be entering the black. There should be a big field up here. There should be a big field up here. And we should be able to exit this field. Up here. And there will be black forest beyond. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I know where I am. I know where I am. If we head straight this direction, we're going to be right back home in a jiffy. Let's do a little wet mushroom farming. That is my meadow. That's my meadow. Listen, I told you there was a field up there, right? Like, I called that field? Of course. Okay. Now we run directly this way, and we should run right into my base. Oh, e shit, chat. E shit. I feel like I, I feel like there's a lot of folks right now. A lot of folks right now feeling awful silly, Toki. Not you. Not you, because I know you believed. What if I don't want to eat it? <laughs> then don't. Then don't. It's only consensual shit eating, okay? I only I only support that. All right, team. I got a lot of good I got a lot of good news for you guys right now. Um Hold on. All right. Let us I hate putting my fermenters in here because Okay, somebody there's there's a there's a dead man out here fucking dead man walking. Hey, buddy. Okay. I hate the... Okay, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We got to come up with a better... We have. We need a better plan, team. Hold on, let me see if I can sleep right now. I need to get that rested buff. I'm, I'm so wet. All right, here we go. We need to get my comfort level up, guys, so we can get a better rested buff. I'm a... I'm a oh, oh, shit. Hold on. I'm a rested buff Andy is what they call me. I can't believe I've only been lost one time. I can't believe I've only been lost one time this entire time. Okay, so let's go see if we can make this bow. <laughs> Comfy and yeah, I got to get my comfort level up. Where do we make the bow? We probably make it here. This bow is going to doink. Okay, I need core wood. Actually, there should be core wood. Did I? I might have. Uh, <clears throat> Where did you guys put all the core wood? Oh god! Not like this. Not like this core wood. Not like this. Oh my god! This bronze axe just actually slaps. Am I still too heavy? No way. Wait, what am I loaded on? Oh. I got it. We left it in the kiln. I made a strategic decision to put some core wood in the in the kiln. Okay, this is going to screw me what I'm doing right now. We're just not going to talk about it. 
Yo, we're about to we're about to pop off though. We're about to pop off. We have a we have a couple of we have a couple of things we need to do right now. But we're about to like pop off. Like we're gonna be T3 full bronze. We're gonna have uh, a fully upgraded uh huntsman bow. We're gonna have disgusting but like in a good way, uh carrot food. Okay, our carrot food in our minced deer meat is what is what can be only described as sicko mode. Sicko mode carrot food, okay? Uh, we probably do need to begin planting some trees. Uh, I have not been to the swamp yet, no, Goldie. Nay. Oh! These assholes, okay. All right, listen. Listen, Goldie. Nobody likes to know it all, okay? Don't, don't well actually me. How dare you? How dare you? Yeah, it was the shaman duo. They, they had to send two of them to try to get the kid, but I was a little too, I was a little too strong. How much core wood? 32 core wood. Um, okay. I take it back. I take it back. Okay. Goldie's okay. Goldie's okay. I didn't I didn't I didn't mean to be a jerk. I've been lost basically one time. Alright, here we go. Can we fully upgrade this fine wood bow? That's the Okay. Not a problemo. Not a problemo. Uh let's drop this bad mamma jamma. We should be able to put it maybe back here and then. Here's the problem. I need something else to go. I wonder if I can tuck it. Aw, oh, bada bing, baby, let's go. All right, upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Uh, T4 bench, T4 bench, T4 bench. Can we do it or no? Oh, yeah, I need. Wait, where did all my flint go? I have, I need that flint. I need that flint badly. Guys, somebody has hidden my flint. And I'm going to find out who it was. I bet it was Gray Mulkin, the flint stealer. Okay, I actually don't have flint anywhere, honestly. Oh my God. I just realized, guys, we're not going to go carrot sicko mode. Oh, these are just the seeds. These are just the seeds, guys. We have another hour. We have another hour until carrot sicko mode happens. Look at that fucking fish right there. Okay. All right, let's pop off right now with my seed. Here we go. Take a shot. No, it's, it's when I say listen. 234 seeds. It's time. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to make it thick in here. I definitely need I need a bigger garden. I need a bigger garden. This will be good for now. There we go. What is this gonna be? Um That is gonna be a lot. Go cliff fish fishing. Cliff cliff fishing? Cliff fishing? You know, I could blow out the back over here and extend that out and make this a bigger garden. If we were, if we were really thirsty for it, you know? All right, one hour. One hour until carrot apocalypse. I want you guys to just be ready. See this tiny little stand bar? Hashtag never again. Uh, neck meat, neck meat, neck meat. Here we go. Ooh, let's go. All right, I'm going to make this minced meat sauce. This is a good health food. I'm going to use all my carrots. Then I'm going to jam. We can only do one jam. And then we'll bore jerky. Thank you, Evnit. I do too. All right, that is actually... This is a decent adventuring combo wombo where's the other one that i made guys wait a minute am i confused oh here it is this is a decent combo that we got going on i'm gonna be honest um we got to get rid of some trash in here 
this can go, this can go. And it can be replaced by that and that. That's trash. And it can be replaced by... That? Where's my cashola? Oh, my! I forgot my cash shop is out here. Come around here. This is my super secret spot over here that nobody knows about. Uh, I'm going to put seeds in there for now. My flint is back here. Okay, so this is 38 pierce. My current one is 28. So we're going to bop shit now. We're going to actually bop shit. Honestly, we can probably... These puke berries uh, can go. This can come down here. We have $255 plus $260. So we're at like $500. We're at $500 right now. $500 big ones. What's the priority right now? The priority is we can't upgrade our armor anymore. Uh, let me take one last look. One last look. We, I, I don't think we can actually upgrade anything anymore, right? Um, we can't upgrade. Can't upgrade. Can't upgrade. Can't upgrade. Can't can upgrade. I do need a little bit more bronze. We can make some more bronze. Yo, Mandy, what's happening? What would it do? Uh, this is going to be a maximum upgrade here. Okay, we are in basically full T3. I think that our focus right now is actually going to have to be getting the fermenters up. We should have... What do we need for it, though? Um, okay, so if I want to do two fermenters, I need 10 bronze. Okay, we do have to go... We do have to go get... We have enough tin. Okay, all I need is a little bit more kappa. Hey, Mandy, the run is going really well. Thank you for asking. We're, um, we're clutching it, as some people say. How's work today, Mandy? I hope you're making a lot of money today, Mandy, okay? As we say in Australia, the dollar redos. We call them... What? There we go. We call... Now that I live in Australia... Uh, I now refer to them as dollar redos. Busy as always. Press X to doubt. That's good to hear, though. That's good to hear. All right, let's get all hopped up. Let's get all hopped up on food right now. Ooh, that felt good. Here we go. Yo, we popping right now? I'm going to be honest with you guys. If we can just make 100 fire arrows... In, I can I can kill the boss right now. Oh, this guy wants to taste my bow. Would you like to taste my bow, sir? Boop. Okay, I thought that I was going to do more damage, but... Taste it. Taste it. Okay, that one I was trying to hit a bird. I don't want to be in a hole. Uh, Guys, hold on. Don't panic. And now we run. Sidestep. Wait, why is my stamp so low? I have my jammy jams on. Alright. Here we go. Nice try, buddy. Alright, big banana damage. Nice try, bud. I know his range now. After that unfortunate death. After that unfortunate swipe this morning. Ooh, that's a 76er in the head. Ooh. This guy lights out full tugger. Hedge. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, we call they're not called jammy jams. I think I think that's what they're called. Breathe it in. All right, we got money. Honestly, I'm mostly killing these guys for the money. I know, Goldie. I know. What were we doing? Oh, we were far we're farming uh farming this kappa. Uh jammy jams can be your pajamas, but they also can be the queen's jam. It's just context. Right? It's context, Goldie. If I was like, hey, do you want to get together and get some lunch? We're having jammy jams. Like, would you bring your pajamas to Cheesecake Factory? 
Hey, Mandy, I actually haven't really looked at anything. I, I, I've been trying not to look at it. I've been trying not to look at the 1.5 changes or any of the updates because I'm just trying to stay focused on, on completing this playthrough without getting sidetracked. I would assume you were a moth. What are the things in alpha animals that I had one time that were eating all my textiles? Uh-oh. Look what we're unearthing here. We're unearthing a giant badonkadonk of, of, of kappa. Oh, you guys don't call them dollar readers. Uh-oh. I don't know. That's not what I heard, Angie. That's not what I heard. I've been to Australia twice, okay? It was like 20 years ago. No, no, no. I'm not saying wear your, wear your pajamas to Cheesecake Factory. Would you meet me for lunch at Cheesecake Factory and eat your jammy jams? That, that was the question. That was the question. Cheesecake Factory is over. What the fuck is this? That's an accidental copper donger. Here we go. Okay, what if they made a, a pajama-flavored cheesecake, Mandy? A pajama-flavored cheesecake. Here we go. Why would we need to bring... What? Oh, AU dollars? I don't know. I don't want to have to fact check you live, Angie. Okay, I don't. I don't want to have to fact check you live, but I feel like they're dollar reduce. <laughs> what is pajama flavor? Uh, well, there's a few types of pajama flavor. Okay, pajama flavor number one, it tastes like fabric softener because these are jammies that just came out of the dryer. Okay, they're warm. They're fuzzy and they taste like fabric softener smells. Okay, that's number one. Number two pajamas that we have taste like naked because some people don't wear pajamas. They just, they, they go to bed naked. So imagine what naked tastes like and that would be, that would be option number two. Option number three are going to be worn pajamas. So they no longer smell like uh, dryer sheets and fabric softener but they have the musk of whoever is wearing them. Okay? I don't know. That's just... That's just kind of like stream of consciousness what I think three options of pajama would taste like. Listen, ask an honest question around here, Goldie. You're going to get an honest answer. Okay? That's what I do. That's what I do. <laughs> like old sweaty, like old sweaty PJs. No, I didn't say old. I just said musky. I just said musky. That's all. Okay, that's all. I mean, I know I'm not the only one. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> I was about to say some weird shit that I was going to hear about for a really long time. So I'm going to just stop. This was about to be. <laughs> Let's just get this copper. Let's just get this copper. Wakes you with another statement about Australia so you could fact check me. Sorry, I didn't mean to offend anybody with dollar reduce. Thank you, Goldie. That's true. Listen, one time I made the mistake of telling chat that I thought like one of my favorite smells is now imagine, imagine you're dating somebody like a significant other. Okay. You've had a long day at work. 
You both come home. Your significant other gets in the shower, takes a shower, and comes sits on the couch next to you. To me, I, all I said was I... I love the smell of like freshly shampooed hair. That's all I said. I, I said, I found that sexy in a relationship. And for like two fucking years, I had people calling me a hair sniffer, which is not- I'm so sorry, majestic creature, but I need to wear your skin. This is, that is not an appropriate, uh, that is not, that's not appropriate characterization of what I'm saying, okay? That's, that's not an appropriate characterization of, of what I was trying to communicate. That's all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why chat would do this to me? This is why I can't trust chat with my deepest, darkest secrets, Goldie. Okay. Uh, the cart. I am so tired of hauling that cart around already. Um, let's get rid of shit. Never trust anyone on the internet. That's so true. That's so true. Um, okay, so we have some choices. Does anybody ever eat baby carrots and not feel like you're chewing on fingers? Okay, people on the internet told me they do. Thank you, Angie. Thank you. I feel like I've been, I was persecuted, okay, for sharing something uh, deeply personable and what I felt was relatable. Oh my God, my rested buff. Wait, did I actually have anything in here? <sighs> nothing I needed, nothing I needed. Let's go get that rested buff. Actually, let's see if we can sleep because we're going to crush that smelting queue right there. Oh, shit. I meant to... Cl I'll close my door. There we go. All right. Rested buff up. Food buffs up. Smelter Q down. Oh, uh, see, Goldie, that, I mean. <sighs> Wait a minute. I have to rethink my position on this about shed hair. S uh, like, smelling, sh mm, I don't know. Is that weird? I don't know if that's actually weird or not. I don't know how to feel about that. Yeah, I don't know how to feel about smelling shed hair, even if it's like consensually shed hair. Guys, I didn't just... Okay, we, we still have all that. Okay, we're okay. Uh, all right, what were we doing? Oh, we were doing, we were doing the fermenters. Okay, so... Oh my god, there's no way I'm out of tin. There's no way I'm out of tin. It's just not... I am... I am mother fluffer. Okay, let's go grab tin. I don't think we went very far this way for tin, so let's, let's give it the old reach around here on the island. Let's follow it this way. But when I'm gathering up hair, I'm a weirdo. I <laughs> need to get out of my house. <laughs> Doc. <laughs> Doc. Oh, man. I need more of it. I need more of it. I like to, I like to make my, my bronze in fives, not ones. Okay. I'm a, I'm a five X. I'm a five X zaddy. Oh my god. This bow actually works. The other one sucks for life. Hey Mandy, enjoy work. I mean that. We're gonna do a quick uh tinny tin tin run here. This bow can actually hit things. I like that. That crude bow can only be summed up in one word, and that is Crude. Crude is doing a lot of heavy lifting in the name of that other bow I was using. That thing was Garbo. <laughs> Gar Garbo. All right. 
I'm gonna let that one go. Yeah, that crude bow is terrible. And it makes me look bad on stream, right? I don't want people coming in here and seeing me fight, fire that crude bow and thinking that I'm a bad shot, Goldie. You know what I mean? I don't need people spreading that around the internet trying to sully my untarnished name. Credit Garbo. I don't think that's not... Garbage. Is that how we say it in uh, in Australia? Wait, how do you not... You have to make that bow. No, no, no. You literally can't skip the first bow or else you can't hunt to be able to make any of the gear. Okay. There's no way you guys are sneak killing gear until you can get to the second bow. It's just not possible. I feel like I'm being trolled. No, 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 no. That's so much work. It's faster just to make the shitty bow in one shot the deer. Throw spear. 293. Uh, all right, let's bring this back. Okay, Goldie, not everybody is kiting trolls to knock down the birch trees to get the fine wood. It's like, it's faster. No, no, no. Listen, I think that I am quickly becoming recognized as an international Valheimen expert. And I say it's easier just to make the shitty bow and learn to use it. I don't know. I've produced... Uh, peer-reviewed research that shows statistically, mathematically and physically that it's just better Val Hyman Val Hyman like of and or pertaining to a player of the game critically, uh, critically acclaimed award winning game, Val Hyman. Here we go. <laughs> I heard correctly. <laughs> yes, yes, you did. Unfortunately, unfortunately. Maybe there's just a better way to say it, but we'll work on it. I'll workshop it tonight. All right, let's get uh let's get the tin loaded. Yo, when those carrots are done, you guys have no idea what's about to happen around this place. I am of the opinion that we may not have the boss here. God. I'm starting, you know, now, like, I've been in, hey, we got to gather, like, bronze mode for a while. And I'm only now beginning to wrestle with the possibility that we will have to sail around the world looking, looking for the boss. I don't know how to feel about this. Oh, my cart is still over there. Let me grab that resin. Also, what am I missing here for minor healing? Oh, shit. Okay, not a problem. Not a problem. All right. Get this. Okay. I need more bees. Good there. Okay, so let's see if we can get... Do we really want to put these in here? Okay, fuck it. We have room. Need three more bronze. <laughs> you see? No, 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 no. It's not like that. Not like that. Okay. Team, the fermenters are in. Uh, we did not because we're such a... I'm like, I'm afraid of losing this base if we go back and try to get it. I, I wish I had a better answer, but I'm only 70% sure that I know where the other base is. Like, honestly. Let me look in. Carrots are healthy. Okay. Okay, we have to go back to the meadows. Because I do need some more snozberries. We definitely need some more snozberries. 
All right, let me do one. Let me do one last check for upgrades. Okay, we can actually we could upgrade trollhide cape, trollhide and bones. Okay, we could upgrade this. We should have trollhide and bones. Let's go snatch. Let's go snatch that trollhide. Trollhide and bones. All right, let's get our cape upgraded. I think it's only like maybe one armor, but you know what they say, guys. One armor could make or break us. Good morning, tags. How are you? Wrong, wrong thing. I am playing. I am playing no map, no portal. Correct. Correct. Okay. So the everything that I have can no longer be upgraded. With the exception of the cultivator, every combat thing that I have cannot be upgraded. So the only thing that we could possibly become more effective with right now, well, we might need wait a minute. I need a I need a badonker. I need a I need a bronze. We should do the bronze mace. Alright, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to the meadows. I'm gonna farm some leather scraps. I'm gonna farm some strawberries. And we'll grab some wood. We're gonna let this bronze cook. I'm gonna make this bronze mace. Wait, what do I need the bronze mace for? I guess for clearing the dungeons. What do I need to clear the dungeons for? Probably for money. Okay, this all makes sense. I feel like we have a very good direction here. Uh, we should just go this way. Sun is rising in the in the east and setting in the west, so we go this way. I don't think we're gonna trip over the boss location here. What if it takes, like, days of adventuring to find a, a boss location, guys? How do we even feel about that? Eight minutes on my rested buff. We should have refreshed that a little better, but... Say la vie, as they say. Also, I should have gotten the honey. Alright, so... That guy's dead. We'll do him in a second. Okay. It's not going to take me... I mean, it might actually take me days. Alright, we are... We're in here. Okay, I just need strawberries and... Hey, back it up. I need strawberries and a bunch of leather scraps. Yo, and flint. I definitely... Oh, God, I do need flint. We're going to have to go back down to the gentle lapping of the waves and farm the flint. But first... There we go. I'm getting I'm getting a refill here. I'm getting a refill here for this uh, this fine wood bow. This modern marvel of ranged physical damage technology. I heard a deer barking. Okay, no. I I can't well I couldn't repair the antler hammer. I couldn't figure out how to repair it. I should try the workbenches now that they've been upgraded. But I, I, it didn't give me the option to repair it earlier, so I don't know. It might be, it might be a one and done hammer. That's my, that was my suspicion. My suspicion was either the hammer was a one and done because it's such a powerful weapon, it wouldn't make sense to just let let them allow you to repair it, or I had to get the workbench leveled up to a certain point uh, to be able to repair it. Those are my, those are my two working theories right now. And I'm, uh, I'm going to solve it, okay? I'm going to solve it. Just you watch. I almost walked by the snozberries, guys. Shit. It was one snozberries. I need two to make one healing potion. I need these dandelions because I think eventually I need those so that I can make uh, some of the... Some potions. Do we call them potions or flasks? Like, what do we... What do we call them? They're not... I mean, I guess they are potions. They look like little potion bottles. All right, I'm going to call them potions. Good good talk, Chad. Good talk.
Okay, they're technically meads, but we can call them potions. Do you know what they call them? <laughs> Do you know what they call them in Australia, though? Yo, yo, give me your meat, Nick. Oh my god, okay. Oh, I have to sneeze, guys? I'm gonna have to mute in a second. Hold on, hold on. Bright light, bright... All right, I'm back. I muted. I muted. We're good. We're good. Fosters. Wait, is that a thing or is that a meme? I feel like I feel like Fosters is just a meme. Okay, let's follow. Let's follow this way. I'm gonna snatch up. I'm gonna snatch up all the flint. I need 15 flint to get my workbench leveled. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, a bevy is short for a beverage. Uh, beverage? Hmm. Is that, it, like, like, how would I use that? Would I ring, would I, would I call? I feel like you guys would say I would ring a friend in Australia. Would I ring one of my friends and be like, would you like to go get a cold bevy down the pub, maybe? <laughs> Maybe that's, maybe that's it. And I, well, would you like to throw back an ice cold bevy? Maybe that's, I bet that's probably it. Uh, let's not get so tunnel focused, uh, tunnel vision on Flint that we miss all the snozberries. Oh, I'm going out for some bevies with the mates. That makes sense. I'm going to be honest with you. Like that. I I, I think I, that makes sense. Picked up some bevies at the servo. No, you got to say down the shore. You don't say go to the beach. You say down the shore. That's how they do it in Jersey. And Jersey is basically Australia. So I, I feel like I feel like via the trans transitive property of Australian culture. It just makes sense to me. Oi, oi, C word. <laughs> oh, no. Chap. You must mean chap. I feel like we're poking fun at Australians right now, and it might not be appropriate. I need 15 flints. Jesus Christ. I feel like I've been looting flints for a half a year. Um, uh oh. I've got bad news. Don't worry, I know precisely where we are, but we have to run out of the flint. I need these necks. Yep, I'll take that. I still want a lizard set. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna write Iron Gate tonight and I'm gonna lay out an argument for why I should be able to make a leather set out of lizard skin. With like a le with like a lizard hat, right? Like a, it, it would be like a hat. Well, hel a helm, not a hat, but like a helm that looks like a that looks like a neck head. Jesus Christ! I'm a sniper. Look, everything I ever knew about Australia comes from one of two places, Angie, okay? Number one, I was in Australia 20 years ago. Twice, okay? I've been to Perth and I've been to Townsville. That's that's the first place that I get my Australian information from. The second place that I get my Australian information from is there is a movie about an Australian serial killer. It's this old guy. I think it's called like Wolf River or River of Blood, whatever it is. And I've never actually watched the movie, but anytime I come across a clip of the movie on TikTok, I watch that. That's the two sources of information that I have about Australia. Wolf Creek, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, Wolf Creek. 
Rivers of Blood is actually like, I think that's a Wu-Tang album. It's either a Wu-Tang album or a RZA album. I forget. Rivers of Blood. It might also just be a, a, a RZA song. Brisbane won Sydney twice. Oh. Townsville was kind of wild. It's like small. It's small compared to, uh, to Perth for sure. But I think Perth is really big. Uh, let's see. Sounds like a sl I don't listen to Slayer. Did I I didn't get my snozberries. Did we get anything we Oh god, we just have to go home. Have you seen the Australian wall that prevent you from going to the center of the continent? I personally have not. No. Wait, you were born in Townsville. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. How old are you? Oh no. Oh no. We have to do some math, cuddle princess. I've got bad news. I've got bad news about my time in Townsville. <laughs> oh no. Uh, yeah, I don't like mosquitoes. Skeeters, not a fan. Dad. <laughs> No, don't you don't need to you don't need to show anybody a picture great. Thank you though. Guys, I better not be burning my I don't I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Oh god, suddenly I'm everybody's dad in chat. Alright, we're looking good. We're looking real good. Went for cigarettes on a naval ship and never came back. <laughs> not like this. We know we're on my street. I'm going to have to stream twice as many hours now. There we go. All right, team. What's my priority? What's my priority? We still have to go to the plains. I, I need one more. I need one more snozberry. Okay, here's what we should do today in this day cycle. Hold on, let me drop all of this shit off. This is a mess in here. Let's go ahead and just... This should be food only, guys. This should just be... Should be food only. Um, like, why... Why... Why are there bronze nails in our food place, right? It just does not make... It just doesn't make any sense. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's slurp up all the nugs. There we go. And do I have enough wood? I know. I need a little bit more wood. We might have to go back to doing morning wood. Jordo. That comes up occasionally, Jordo. The suck my suck my neck nasty denim daddy comes up occasionally, Jordo. It's one of your finer works of fiction. Morning wood with killer. Yeah, we're probably gonna have to go back to doing morning wood at this rate. We're wasting, I'm wasting way too much time afternoon wooding. What's up, Jordo? This guy doesn't know I got a new axe, or else he wouldn't be faffoing. There we go. Hopefully, okay, I have enough wood. I feel like we were supposed to get the walls up on the base today, guys, but. Oh, this mother fluffer. This is why, this is why I need it. There's so much riffraff. Yeah, nobody actually gets to hit my kilns but Thank me. Thank you for your follow. Hey, Juvis, thank you for the follow, my friend. A handy. I'm not going all the way to New Zealand for a handy. Okay. Okay. Those are pretty... It's pretty cheap around here. <laughs> all right. I was, there's just... There's faster ways is all I'm going to say. No offense. No offense, but... Um, 
Hold up, what do I need? That's all that's all good. Alright, we're good there. Hold up. Oh, a hunky. Oh, that's completely different. I don't know what a hungy is. No. Okay. Well. Well, uh, the, the, this is awkward. This is awkward. This is awkward. Oh, it's an oven in the ground. Uh, we might be able to go a little, hold on. Hold on, maybe later. Okay. We may be able to go a little later today. Maybe not that much. Maybe not that much. Uh, I gotta go. We gotta go. I need more snozberries. All right. I need flint and I need snozberries. Uh, but the good news is, like, I'm reasonably sure. Yeah, let's get the flint, let's get the snozberries, and I'm going to start trying to take a few different paths to see if we can just accidentally find the elder uh, location if it's out here. Uh, we could also clear a few of these dungeons once I get my mace made. We probably should have tried to repair, we'll try to repair the stag breaker. This is what I do. I'm going to do one more run to the, down here to the meadows. Then, when I go back, I'm going to start the healing potion. I'm not leaving the meadows until I get snozberries. We're going to start the healing potion. So that's going. We're going to pick the carrots. We're going to make the carrot food. We're probably going to have to add a chimney to the existing base. Because we're going to need a spot to cook my meat. Then, <clears throat> we're going to start seeing if we can find... <laughs> Goldie, you ain't see shit. You ain't see what happened. Nobody saw what just happened. <laughs> oh, no. Here we go. The Meadows is right here, guys. <laughs> I knew that I was headed back towards my base, Goldie. Okay? I knew my base was right there. <laughs> I wasn't lost, okay? I wasn't lost and accidentally ran in a circle back to my base. I know that's what it looked like, but that's not what happened. Let's explore this way a little bit. I kind of want to see what's out here. If that's my base, I fucking quit. Okay. All right. Here we go. Check this. Blah, blah, blah. All right. This coast here to the left will take us back to our house. What do you guys think is over there? That's more... Is that more Black Forest? I don't know why. I feel like the boss location... Is nearby. We should also build the ship, guys. We should also build the ship. I keep thinking I'm just going to stumble upon, like, a giant flat place. And it's going to be the boss location. This might be a dungeon down here. Oh my god, this is where I was lost like 30 minutes ago. I was lost AF out here. Okay, there's no dungeon over there. All right, I know where I am. I know where I am. The coast that way is the shortest way home. We already followed the coast that way and we got a little lost. We got a little turned around.
All right, I kind of want to cut up through here. There should be some strawberries on the edge here. Also, oh, I forgot. We're trying to make the bronze mace, guys. Bronze mace, snozberries. Wait, what? Buddy, you're fucking up my hunting. Let's stay focused. Bronze mace, snozberries, boat, healing potion. Uh, I don't mind swimming. I hate drowning. Yeah, now swimming. Swimming isn't a problem. It's the drowning that sucks. Look at this fellow. Look at this big old two-star neck right there. I don't know how far this goes this way. Uh, we already got all the flint here. This is where we want to be. I kind of want to draw a line like... What the fuck is this? Bees? Bees, please? No bees. Okay. No, there's no goddamn way that there's not any strawberries out here. It's not possible. It's not new. new yeah, no newbies. No newbies in there. I don't even know if I need deer. I mean, I guess I need deer meat. Oh, look at this guy. No, there's no way I've missed the strawberries. Like, there, I need one fucking strawberry for one for for six healing potions. The only thing that's stopping me from killing this boss, in addition to having no idea where it is and probably completely losing our base trying to find it, is the simple fact that I can't find one single strawberry. Someone picked all the snozberries. Oh my god. Okay. Actually, these this neck me is gonna be is gonna be dope. Let's see if uh oh the flint is back. Oh wait, the flint is back. Alright. I need one strawberry for the for the love of Odin. Where would someone even find such a thing? And and now I'm back in the BF. Ain't no strawberries in the BF in the fucking 303 if you know what I'm saying. Thank you Goldie. I still stand by it. I stand by it. Nobody has debunked my my neck shit theory, okay? Not a single person has been able to debunk it. So, the absence of evidence against my theory is the evidence of absence for it. The waves washing up. Have you ever seen a wave washing rocks up on the shore? There we go. Thank you, Angie. I'm glad you, I'm glad you got it. Everybody else is half-stepping. One strawberry. I literally need... It's got to be one right here. Have you ever actually seen... an? You know what? Um, just because... I, have you have you ever seen an elephant hiding in a tree? No. Well, it's a pretty good place to hide an elephant, isn't it, Yosemite? There's some flaws in your logic. Just because... You know what? I've never actually seen electricity... But I know when I flip the switch, the lights go on. 
Uh, right now, I would take a raspberry. I would take a schnozberry. Look, look. Where do they all go? They're all missing. This forest is too quiet. It's missing all the snozberries. There's like 30 snozberry plants here. I didn't pick them all. I bet it was Grimhawk. I bet Grimhawk is in my server slinking around like fucking Bigfoot. Slurping all my snaz berries. Have I ever seen an arc of current like a lightning strike? Uh, I'm going to say no, because if I say yes, I feel like it's going to contradict my, my current working theory about having never seen electricity. Yeah, what's happening, buddy? How are you? Well, look, we failed today. We failed pretty hard. We did not, we did not achieve the goals that we set out to achieve. I do not have 50. I have one flint, no snozberries for an entire day cycle. It's going really well, Yid. Thank you. We are doing a no map, no portal run of Valheim. Okay. Here's what I think. I think that the elder is not on our island. And we're going to go back. What do I need for the carve? Let's grab a little bit of extra wood. No map, no portal, no raspberries. That's right. Listen, uh, Gray, I can't keep track of the people that are in my stream right now. Nonetheless, the people that were here yesterday, you know this. Let's eat this. Even the VIPs, Gray, and also Yed. The reason I'm really excited about an Elden Ring uh, run is so I can show Yed how it really gets played. It's good of you to not have anyone matter more. Uh, thank you. It's very egalitarian. Okay, we're very egalitarian here. I come here with the assumption that Killa thinks it's his first time streaming. Everything is doing awe inspiring, and I will not thank you. Thank you, Yed. I'm like a fucking child. I'm like a child on Groundhog Day. I'm like a. What was that movie with Adam Sandler? 50 First Dates. It's like every day Chat and I are on a date, but it's like our first date. I'm not going to die to a bunch of hooligans. Drew Barrymore. Uh, 28. Let's drop this. I need one more. One more tree. I'm going to leave these stumps to guide our way, by the way. I'm usually... Uh, <laughs> I'm usually a bit of a stump grinder, but sometimes you have to leave the stumps unground. Wait, am I Drew Barrymore in this movie? Wait. Yeah, Drew Barrymore was the one that had her, uh, that who, he didn't have the memory, right? All right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, we're looking good, looking good. <laughs> you guys are Adam Sandler and I'm Drew Barrymore. That's fair. You know what? I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad. I understand my shortcomings. I embrace my shortcomings. Guys, nobody would watch this channel if I was a normal, like, well-adjusted human being, right? Like, if I, if I actually could remember anything, if I was actually good at video games, if I was not lazy, like, you guys would not watch this channel. 
the only people that would watch this channel would be the people who want to fall asleep to my voice. That's it. That's it. It would be like five people. The under the other 900 people. Let's go watch something else. Then go watch the Ed. I come in here one day and kill X normal. Frankly, I'll be. <laughs> Yeah, he's been body snatchered. Killa got body snatchered. He's acting normal. He's remembering things. He's reading tooltips. Something is very wrong. Something is very wrong. Listen, all of us have... Are they called foibles? Wait. All of, all of us have foibles. Should I go in here? I don't have a rested ball. Fuck that shit. We all have our quirks and our foibles, okay? I just put mine... On display. That's all. Yo, that is a lot of skellos right there. We're gonna get out of here. Foy balls? No, no, foibles. F O I B A L L S. Yeah, it's F O I, Watson. F O I. Fucking degenerate. Alright, we're gonna head home. Guys, there's blueberries everywhere. Oh, jeez, look at this guy coming in hot on me. Hey, bud, get parried. You see this? This is why I'm the Elden Lord. You see this? Oh, I'm out of stamina. The Elden Lord is currently out of stamina and cannot parry. But come back and try that again. I am the Elden Lord. Ow. Oh, he only hit me for five. Eat shit, buddy. I'll face tank that guy all day, twice on Tuesdays. Ah, the foey grass. No, not the foey grass. That's not what I'm talking about. Something completely different. Foibles. Foibles. I think fo I think foibles are like quirks, okay? It's like it's like when you're quirky. But I couldn't answer Grimhawk's rigged uh, rigged math question earlier, so I don't know. Maybe I'm just dumb. That's possible. It's possible. Also, I know precisely where I am. Lest anyone think that I am lost. My house is right up this way. Idiosyncrasies. Could be. Wait, what? No, I have not. I hate hair, Denise. I mean, I don't mean this. Like, hold on. Okay, listen. I will just leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. Any way to attempt to exp... Wait. Wait. Wait, how are we in the meadows? Guys, my house. Oh, God. We're at the Nobis place. Oh, guys, we missed our exit. <laughs> guys, we missed our exit. Yeah, we did. <laughs> we missed our exit and we circled back around. There was construction and a detour and... What's up, Danger Noib? How you doing? Well, now I'm... Um... Now I'm chilly, Willy, and we're going to... Mm. I did say I did say that, but now I'm scared. It's nighttime and it's spoopy. It's a little spoopy out here. Also, my skelly friends. Oh, that's a, I'm going to call them my skelly friends from now on. My skelly friends are taking care of business back there. Where's that big... Okay, I know where I am. It is, watch this. I'm going to walk in a straight line this way and we'll run directly into my base. It's going to, it's a little bit because I don't have any stamina and we're cold and we're a little ways away. We just walk in a straight line into the black forest. Should be a big field. There's my field. God. God. Ferdinand fucking Magellan strikes again, guys. How does the kid do it, Einrig? He's cold and there's wolves. I've been there, done that. Mr. Rested. <laughs> I mean, we could, uh, we could, we could boof up our comfort level a little bit in the base. That way we can range out. Okay, bud. Okay. 
Here we go. I told you guys straight this way, straight this way. Okay, we're not stumbling around fighting things by chance. I know my base is exactly this direction over here. No, this is going to get a little bit saucy right here. Because I am getting chased by a blowy dude. And there's a spawner right there. But my base is right over here, team. And I know that because of the way it is. I know you don't want to you don't want to see anything right now. This is why we don't travel at night. This is why we don't travel at night. It is ill advised to travel at night in this game because the all the all the hooligans come out. Okay. My username. My username. It just, it was a random name generator. N random name generator is all it was, my friend. Was this my base or no? Yeah, it was just a random name. Ooh, it was just a random name gener generator from like 10 years ago. And the name just kind of stuck, and I've used it ever since. Yeah, it was like I used it for a while while I was PvPing. And then people started to recognize me in other games. And I was like, well, I can't switch it now because I'm fucking internet famous. But that's the burden of internet fame, guys. Yeah, it was just random name generator for a death knight. It was a goblin death knight, like of all things, right? There I am just trying to get a name for a goblin death knight. And then suddenly... It's the name that I get known by in every game that I play, now streaming, even at the grocery store, even at the grocery store, when people recognize me, they're just yelling it out. I don't remember that being there. If I am where I think I am. Rough to the zoo. Enjoy. Enjoy the zoo, Lizzie. Have a lot of fun. And thank you for hanging out this morning. And I will be uh, I will be live tomorrow, guys. Tomorrow is going to be a 9 to 4.30. I do have my son tonight. How do we keep making the same mistakes over guys, and over, I know, and over again? Guys, I know right where the base is. I know right where the base is. I was headed to the vendor. Enjoy. Yeah, I'll be here 9 to 4.30 tomorrow. I've got my son. And then I think Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday are all going to be late streams. Well, maybe all day streams. Like, we'll be going till 11 p.m. Uh, all right, let's sell some things. 36 bucks. Let's go. Get a friend that tried multiple names. All the names were taken or not allowed. Can't and... Oh. There you go. Well, listen. That's it. It's one way to do it. I probably could have got arrested buff back there. I don't even want to loot those blueberries anymore. I'm so bitter about the snozberry situation that I don't even want the blueberries anymore because they just make me angry. I want to drag this guy along. My base should be up the shore here. Should be almost home any minute. As I'm slow waddling here through the cold. You guys know where I am, right? Up around the next bend. As CCR said. We're going up around the bend. And there it is. Just like I said, we ran directly at it. Boom, 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 bada bing. There's the base. I'm going to have to kill all of these guys. Is a hot dog a sandwich? Uh, yes. Yeah, a hot dog is a sandwich. Of course it is. It's kind of impossible to argue otherwise. So it, it has to be. Yep. Yo, if my carrots are ready? Yeah, it's a pretty easy one. That's a pretty easy one. Hot dog, definitely a sandwich. No, no. No, it's a sandwich. It's definitely a sandwich. 
Is hot dog water a broth? Yes. Uh, y y like, listen. You guys are all wrong. You guys are all wrong. It's not a taco. <sighs> God. Guys, I don't even... I don't even have time to get into how fucking wrong you guys all are. Except for, uh, except for Grimhawk. Grimhawk is right. It's, it's like, it, and you guys know that I would not give Grimhawk credit for anything. Okay. A taco is a taco, but a hot dog is a sandwich. That's just, that's, that's just a, that's just a fact, guys. Yo, let's go with the carrots, baby. There we go. Wow, let's see what we're gonna make here. We're about to make some big banana food. Minced meat sauce. Uh, yep. Carrot soup. Oh my god. Oh, ho, 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 ho. and yo, okay. We have to solve a problem that we have right now, chat. All right, hold on. Hold on. Hold that thought. We have a... Okay, hold up. Hold up. Let him cook. Let him cook. Where'd the fucking seeds go? Where's my cart? Did I put the seeds on the cart? All right. Some of my seeds are here. All right, we're good. We're good. All right, guys. I'm about to pop off. Some of us are correct and some of us are killer. That's that's toxic. That's toxic. I think I hid my seed. What? There's no... Uh, you want to go get one of those gyros. You want Here's what you want to do. You want one of those like Greek... Is it Greek? The gyros? You want to go get like a a chicken gyro. At, like find the best gyro place near you. They always have great french fries too. So what you want to do is find the best gyro place around. You want to get a chicken gyro with that tzatziki sauce or, or, or whatever that stuff is called. And uh, you want to get like a nice sloppy gyro. With the tzatziki sauce, like just like fucking juicing out of it every time you take a bite. With some french fries. Or a shawarma. Yep, those are delicious too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tzatziki sauce is so good. Oh, we only have eight of these left. Um, okay. Okay, I know what I have to do, guys. We should just stop putting it off. Um. Oh, God. Oh, God, not like this. Okay. Okay. Um. Uh, hold on. How much wood do I have? Hold on. I gotta have a shitload of wood somewhere. Okay, guys. I'm so sorry what we have to do here. But we have to make some, uh, some amendments. Uh, Angie, we do not call them dollar dues in Australia. Someone of, uh, somewhat dubious. A somewhat dubious source. Okay. A dubiously, possibly... Uncredible source told me that in Australia we do not call them dollar redos. All right, let's snack on these. I wanted to hit that bird. Uh, all right, I need a little bit of wood. We have we have to put in uh, we have to put in some extra cooking slots here. Get that rested buff. Oh my god, Yed owes me $50. Yed, 
every time someone backseats, they have to pay me $50, okay? If they backseat or spoil, one backseat e equals $150. So, I will accept, uh, I will accept pay uh, PayPal. It's, ju it's just pay PayPal. Sorry, Ed. I bet that you didn't expect to be $50 lighter when you came into the stream today, did you? And my my favorite my favorite is when Yed pays me on PayPal, and if he doesn't have a business account, I'm gonna find out that his real name is Yedimus Maximus Meridius, father to a murdered son, husband to a murdered wife. And I will have my vengeance in this life or the next. Uncredible source unsubscribed. Oh no. Not like this. Angie, please forgive me. I, Moo, that was me. That was actually me. I know you thought that I was, I didn't want to, I don't want to get sued. So I didn't, I wasn't playing a clip, dude. That was like, that was legit me. A lot of people say that I look like Russell Crowe. Like basically bald, no beard. When Russell Crowe, like I, I look like Fat Damon. Uh, like I look like the, not really fat Russell Crowe. More like fat Gerard Butler, maybe. I don't know. Uh, hold on. Let's get this. All right, let's just start ripping and tearing because... All right, that's got to go. That's got to go. Oh, this might be a lot easier. Hold on. This might be a lot easier. Hmm. God, I wish my base was bigger. This is not our forever home. We're, this home is going to be lost. Like, mark my words, okay? I don't want to lose it, but... I do believe there's like a 1,000% chance at some point we're going to adventure on the high seas. The problem is I definitely need a pit right now with a thing in it. And... There we go. Yeah, I don't want to act like Crustle, Crustle Row. Correct. Correct. And let's go ahead and get us a, an El Chimno on here. This one should be pretty easy. Sometimes I'm like too lazy to just do like... This is... This... This is not how we... Mm, we could have just left it. We could have just left it like it was, like it, like it be. But let's not, let's not build some type of fucking trash goblin base, you know? It's not terrible. It's not terrible. Just watch. I'm going to give it the love touch right now. I have to remember how to do the love touch, though. I think it was like... It was maybe... And... Snap it here. Yeah, of course. Now, uh... <clears throat> but... There we go. Look, it's fine. I, I think it's fine. I think it's okay. Listen, all I need to do is cook some deer legs. Let's get let's get some deer legs on the Barbie. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, why is it not exhausting? Hold on. What? What? Hold on. Um, okay. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Um. Oh, 
Okay. 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 It'll clear. It'll clear out. It just needs to vent a little bit. All right. There we go. I should have done another one on this side, but it'll be fine. All right. What we're going to do is wait, where the fuck all my mushrooms go? Okay. Those mushrooms need to be in here. Okay. Let's go ahead and make up. There's no way I have like 250 hours. Oh God, my meat is gonna burn. All right, there we go. There's no way I have like 250 hours in this game and I still can't build a chimney. This is not possible. Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. Um, Yep, watch this. And then come in here. And then, yep, 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 yep. There we go. There we go. Okay. Guys, there's like a giga ventilation right now. There's no reason we shouldn't be properly ventilated. All right. There we go. Perfect. Let's get back to cooking. Let's get back to cooking. All right. Carrot soup. Ten of them coming up, baby. Let's watch the meat. Let's watch the meat. How many of these did I say I was making? 10? All right, my meat is done. I want to make sure we have enough for everything. All right, eight. All right, minced meat sauce. We should be able to do 10. They hit me with that thick gravy. There we go. This is why I had to kill all those boars and farm all the neck tails. Okay. What am I? Uh... There we go. Okay, beautiful. And last but not least, yo, we are fully black forested out of our minds right now. Like we could actually do some adventuring. Like this food I have is like sicko mode. Kara soup cooking stream, never. Trust me, you guys, you guys don't want to, you, know, you guys don't want an IRL cooking stream. So, what's going on, buddy? Yo, sicko, like actual sicko mode food right now. Um, good, 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 good. Sorry if I'm cutting off. Are you gonna take a look? Yeah, when I when I get it, like when I get a chance, bud. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, I mean, I literally went to bed last night and then just like woke up this morning and started streaming. Um, I'll take I'll take a look at it. I'll take a look at it this afternoon. I know a couple of folks are interested, so uh, let's put that in there. Okay. No, no, no. You're you're good. You're good, dude. I'll I'll uh, I'll take a look today. Um, okay. So. What are we going to do? I wonder if I can reach the rest of my carrots. Oh, it can. What? Hold on. Yo, get ready for like gig of thick food. Okay. All right, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. Like... I can't upgrade. The only thing we can do is literally... Well, we can make our boat. Let's make our boaty boat real quick. We got to make the carve. 
I need 80 bronze nails and 10 deer hide. I think I've got the deer hide up here. We may or may not have the bronze. We probably do not. Let me see how much bronze we can make. Okay, we're at 20 bronze nails. I actually think I have bronze nails. We might... Shit. I have 10 bronze nails. Okay. So we do need one more bronze. Hold on. The problem is going to be the deer, the deer skins. That's the, that's the big problem. Oh, okay. So I do need one more bronze. This should be all good. Load these up. That's good. Uh, okay. We should be, I, I got to go get one more strawberry and we need one more bronze. And then, I mean, honestly, like I have, like I could just go, oh, fire arrows. We do need to make fire arrows. Okay. All right. Well, we need to go back to the plains, but I'd say we're going to do, let's go back to the plains, rest above eight minutes. If we were really like actual gamers, we would go back and refresh that rested buff, but. Who's got that time? Nobody's got that kind of time. We're at uh, top tier weapons, top tier armor, top tier food, top tier arrows, just some potions. Also, did we clear this? Because I need money. If I can get a bajingling, if I could get a bla, a bla oh, we did not clear this. No. No way, Jose. Wait, did we? Nope. Doors are closed. All I really want out of here is money. I don't really care about anything else. Oh, fuck. Also, like, nothing in here can kill me, so it just doesn't matter. I'm like, I'm like out healing. I'm out healing all of this annoying shit. Well, okay. Look at this. Look at this little fella. Oh, yeah. Fuck. There we go. All, oh, boy. Because of course. Because of course. Uh, we got a little bit of money. There we go. Location's already added, team. Let us go. Looking for Yag. No, I am currently looking for the Elder. Jeez, Louise. Okay. Well, at least we'll have plenty of cores for the portals, right? Drop this. Drop these. There better not be any more cores in here. Actually, we probably should just like bank these bank these cores in the boat. Before we start traveling again. Uh which way did we not go? Okay, we're good this side. Okay, left side clear. Center. That's it. All I want is money. The elder has all the strawberries. It probably is. All right. There was actually nothing there. All right. I'm going to get a ton of stamp because I'm going to have to come through this door hard right now. There's a spawner in there and I'm coming in swinging. Okay. Okay, I don't hate this. I wish I could, uh... Jesus Christ. The game is actually taunting me right now. The game is actually taunting me. There was two boss location stones in here. Oh, hello, mate. Go for a bevy. Um... Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. This, this, this is no portal, yes. I was just seeing who was paying attention. Yo, we getting loads in here right now. We fucking catching loads. Here we go. 
Oh. We're about to get that bajangalang. Look at this. We got everything. We got this. What's my weight? 252. You know, this place is rich with stuff, though. Which way did we go? Did we not go? Let's go deep. Yo, this, this, this place is nuts. Oh, okay. Here comes the streamer luck. Here comes the streamer luck accusations. Okay, well, that was a dead end. I'm going to have to hear. Oh, wait. I think we. Hold on. Okay. Yo, this place was juicy AF. How much money? 124. 224. 320. We're like actually wait, does anybody remember? I just saw the exit, but I, I didn't I didn't want to believe it was true. Let's try this way. Okay, this, I gotta remember. Wait, maybe we missed something. Go, we didn't. You know what I thought about? What about these things? What if we can destroy these? Doesn't appear that we can. Okay, it's a good try. Good try. All right, I'm gonna follow the right wall until we get home. It's not. It's not there. It's not there. It's not up there. Okay. This is an old tracking trick. When you're lost, follow the right wall. Oh, here we go. Wait, I missed. I think I missed a right wall. Did I miss it? There we go. Okay, this one is actually empty. Okay, we gotta log this one. Oh shit, it is nighttime. Nighttime is not the right time. Shit, here we go. Oh no, it's not gonna let me log it. No, 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 no. I don't wanna go in there. I wanna log it. Um, hold on. Can we put a shit? I gotta mark this. Okay, we're gonna have to use the elements, okay? I'm gonna drop this tree on it. I'm gonna drop this tree onto this thing. That way we know we've been in there. From now on. We're gonna mark it with... That literally could not be any better. Fuck, I don't know where home is, guys. I've got bad news. Ah, Wait, what's that light over here? I just saw a light. Oh! Oh, my house is right fucking here. Okay. That light was my house, I think. Uh, that one doesn't have the shelter gray, so if I build a wall, it's gonna deteriorate. If if you have to, if you build it, if you if you get the shelter tag, you can build stuff in there and it won't deteriorate. If you don't get the shelter tag, the wall will just like turn green and deteriorate and fall apart. All right, buddy, I'm the Valheim master. Bow down when you come to my town. Here we go. Roast beef sounds delicious, dude. I would I would go for that. I would actually go to your parents and eat roast beef. Well, well, well. Perry God strikes again, guys. Nah, you ain't getting away, son. Okay. Yeah, I made it home like in the fuck. Hold on. Let me check my let me let me check my stash real quick. Let's do some stash math. Let me make sure I don't have any valuables around anywhere else. You know what, Gooch? Nobody really knows, dude. Like nobody actually knows how I do it. 
Especially the people that watch me do it. They're still stunned. All right. I got to do a quick stash check and see if we are getting close. Here's the sad thing. If we actually knew how to get to the other base, we would have enough money for our bejingling. God, that would be so good. Uh, What do we got for money? So I have 400 plus 360 is like 765 plus 80. Fuck. We're so close. Wait a minute. Plus 80. Plus 80. 40 pounds. Um, wait a minute. Wait a minute. 405 plus 360. We'll call it 760. Plus 80 is 840. Plus 80 is 920. I need 9. Wait a minute. 9. Plus 4. There's no way I'm $10 away. That doesn't seem right. Let's try to go liquidate. Whoops. Let's go to, let's go try to liquidate these assets real quick. And if we can find Oh, well, let me repair. One more dungeon and we have our bejingling. Wait, look at the price of them again. Yeah, it says value 380. Value 80. Value 80, 380 plus 160 is 540 plus 406 is 940. I'm still like, I'm still like a couple dollars short. Unless I'm misunderstanding how numbers work or the game works. What we're going to do is head down here and... I might even take a look, like, at some of the ones we've done. Because I might have actually just left some, like, some... See, that one is marked for sure. There should be another one over here. Between the vendor and I. I see we take a little look-see over here. This guy really wants to just get fucking whacked. But first, carrots. Guys, what are we going to do about the strawberry problem? I think that we have a very crippling and acute strawberry problem. Yo, there might be money in here. There might also be a troll in here, too. I don't know if I want to fight. I don't know if I want to fight the troll in here. Okay, is it a one star? Oh, God. Okay. I mean, if we if we kill a troll, we might actually get enough money. Like a troll drops... What else drops money? You know what we could do? Hold on. I have an idea. We could sell plasma. I could donate sperm. Also... There might be a treasure chest in these. Sometimes these have some chests. How else do we find money? Zero setbacks today, truly. I mean, we haven't really done... We haven't even really... We farmed, we farmed a lot of today. We haven't really engaged... Sell a kidney like a real man. I'll sell one of my livers. I'll sell one of my livers. That's why we get two, right? What's up, hybrid germ? This might be another dungeon here. Oh, we about to get that bejingling team. And we'll be able to carry all of the things with our bejinglings. Please tell me doors closed, doors closed, doors closed. All right, we're live. Look alive. Ooh. Yo, let's get juicy right now. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, team. Whoa, that was a mistake. I'm going to take that wood. I'll drop this. There it is. We should have enough. We should have enough. Boom. 
but I'm also a greedy little goblino, so I'm not going to stop here. The loot goblin must loot goblin. Only, only death can stop me. Okay. They were trying to run a classic hammer and pincer maneuver on me. Wait, is it anvil and pincer maneuver? Scumbag. There we go. Game cannot stop taunting me with the map locations either. All right, we must, uh, we must farm. Wait, did I? Yeah, we don't need that shit. Came in here. Came this, came this way. Came this way. Grab this. Guys, we do we make the boat? We never made the boat, guys. I should put the cores in the boat that we don't have. Guys, if these mushrooms were strawberries, we could make so many potions. Jesus, this is just never ending. It ended right there. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. All right. I'm gonna get a little bit of stam. Nah, we cannot let the bow sink. Wait a minute, is that it? I mean, that other one was a real long donger, so. Um, we cannot let this boat sink, guys. We There shall not be any boat shenanigans. We're going to have some rules. We're going to have some rules on Daddy's boat this time. Okay, first, first rule of Daddy's boat. This run, no sinking. Rule number two, no drugs or alcohol, okay? No drugs or alcohol on Daddy's boat. I actually cannot believe how many fucking cores I have. This is actually insane. Oh my God. Yo, we rich right now. We're core rich, house poor. No texting, whoops. <laughs> no texting and driving on daddy's boat. True, big true. No sandbars. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I think we're good. We're good. We're good. That was it. Let us go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Snatch these. All right, how many cores? I have 18 cores on me. Oh, my God. Okay, so... <clears throat> we have to mark this one with a log. Oh, God. There's no good logs. I'm going to drop this one expertly right here. I'm going to jump and push it when it starts falling. Here we go. Okay, maybe I need I need one more log. It's a marker. Here we go. This was probably the one I should have just went with in the beginning. These guys, like, please stop it. They're going to make me drop. God damn it. Okay. Okay. So let's get rid of this one. All right. Drop this one. This is the one we should have gone with. If these guys hit me with their stupid rocks and fuck up my logging. What? What? All right. There it is. Okay, everybody, you're just going to have to remember. You're just going to have to remember that the one with the log that didn't drop right, we've been in there. Honestly, I don't think we're ever going to have to do another dungeon because we have enough money. Let's go back and convert some of our money. If I remember, if I remember correctly, the vendor is near by. I thought she was right there. Um, 
Uh, I would say probably, well, maybe. I'll have to hear from his mom. She ended up taking her to the trampoline park, so they're there right now. I'll text her and see what time. This might be a good opportunity to get a schnoz if they've regrown. Uh, yeah, you're probably safe too, Gray. Thank you, by the way. Look, I'm not looking for the vendor. Like, I know where she is. I'm just trying to get... I'm trying to get some strawberries right now. Hmm. Still no strawberries to be seen. No rested buff. No schnozberries. Oh! Yes. Wait. Oh my god, I almost didn't loot it. Um. Could you imagine if I got all the way home and realized I hadn't looted that? Also, drop this and this. Did I get the leather? I need the scraps to make my bunker. There we go. Yeah, I would like to make the bronze mace. I mean, I guess I was going to make the bronze mace for clearing dungeons, but I feel like I feel like that's kind of done, honestly. But bronze mace would be good for the swamp ola, which is coming up right after we kill the elder. Okay, that lady should be near. Wait, if this is my house, is this my... This is not my house, right? Okay. I know where I am. I've got my bearings. Uh, it's time to go home and make my healing potions. As we, as we make final preparations for a boss kill. Uh, was this bees or no bees? No bees. Like we've checked that one a couple of times, honestly. But you can never be too sure. Oh, I just thought of something. We should have been killing deer. We also should have had stamina too. We need the uh, we need the deer to make the boat, to make the carve. Now I gotta drop something. I think I needed uh, 10 of these. Mother Fluffer. I think I have plenty of resin at home. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Angie with the puns. The Graylings have been beating the strawberries. It makes sense. It's really the only thing that makes sense. I'm just going to whack this one off. Save arrows. Okay. So I uh I think we got maybe another 30 minutes here today ish. But tomorrow we're going to build the boat and set sail and we're going to try to find some more black forest. So I think that tomorrow we're going to have to think through what our naval navigation is going to truly look like. All right, this is, this is my field. Because 
once we start to go out in the world and explore like yeah it's gonna be boat launch tomorrow once we go out into the world and start to explore like that's when we're gonna begin to run the risk of losing our base here but i'm gonna bring i'm gonna bring some cores i'm gonna try to bring some copper some cores I mean, there's there's a good chance. Yeah, I think there's a good chance that we're lost tomorrow and have to. We'll just pop a new base down. If we get lost tomorrow, then I'm gonna commit to just scouring Black Forest. Like I say, we don't put a base down because we don't need to make anything other than maybe food. Like we don't need to craft anything, right? Like if we do get lost tomorrow, I'm just gonna scour uh, Black Forest looking for Elder location. Once we find our location, then maybe we'll put a mini base down so that we can go ahead and get like our rested buff and make 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 some food and preparations for the boss kill. So I think that I'm not going to go out of my way to lose this base tomorrow, but I think I'm when we leave, we will do so with the understanding that we may never see it again. All right, um, because that I think that is an eventuality. So yeah, if we get lost, we just ride the we just ride the high tide until we find Elder. So then we pop a mini base down, get buffed up, kill Elder, and then we climb back in our boat. And I mean, if we really really get lost, we could Yeah, that's it. That's the only thing. If we lose this base, the only thing we can really do is just try to find try to find Elder. Um, we find Elder, kill Elder, get the, get the key ring for the swamp. And then we just try to like, try to find a big swamp with like maybe five or six catacombs in it. And then we're probably going to have to refarm some stuff like the fermenters and things like that. Hey, killer, can you hit M? You can't, the M button does not work. The M button actually does not work. There is no M button. Yes, Cab, that's true. No, I think we're going to be okay. Okay, okay, Kablooey. Why you do this? I, God, I hate you. I can't believe you do this. Um, all right, let's go to sleep. Now we won't restart. We won't restart. I mean, the reality is we're probably already really tight, um, on time on this one. I mean, I have a hard stop on the 29th, right? I've got 12 days. I've got 12 days to get as far through this as I possibly can, because we will, we will have a hard stop on the 29th for the Path of Exile League. I kind of want to let's get rid of that. And all right, all of our valuables are here. I mean, I will come back to this, assuming that we're assuming we're not like mid death spiral. If I have to break from this, I'll come back. Like I'm committed to beating this game. It's just, you know, with the with the path of exile league on the schedule that's kind of a thing you know i'm committed to all right let's go ahead and sleep this one off okay god i don't know where the vendor is i thought the vendor was just up the beach guys i thought the vendor i thought the vendor was up the beach uh let me see if i can find what time let me see if i can get a better time here go up and repair and
All right, sorry, I'm trying to confirm confirm pickup time. All right, let's grab a little bit of copper. I need a few more nails. We can get this boat down. Jesus, we like strip mine this place. Oh shit, there we go. That is true, that is true. I just have to navigate with my heart. Okay, looking good, looking good. There we go. I was like, why am I not slurping? Why am I not slurping the nugs right now? I did, it just wasn't close enough. I mean, honestly, let's get let's get this uh, copper started. I'm gonna try to get a whole a full load here. Let's get this copper started, and then I'm gonna grab all the money and see if we can go find the vendor. I think it's just up the beach. I think it's just up the way. As they say. That's 13. Should really get like another four or five out of this. Yo, it's just raining. 15. 16. Okay, beautiful. You think it's over yonder? Yeah, let's get these nugs rolling. We switched to heart navigation in times of crisis. Yes. That is that's exactly what it is, yummies. Thank you for your follow. Hey, sausage. Okay, hold on. Got hold on. Ah, <laughs> uh, those don't go there. Alright, those are rocking and rolling. Okay, let's grab everything. Let's do the math. 456 plus 60, 510 plus 400, 910. Okay, we got plenty. We got plenty. We got plenty. All right. Um, I'm going to follow this coast. Okay, I'm gonna navigate. <clears throat> I'm gonna navigate with my heart. Okay, I'm gonna navigate with my heart. We should be bejingling shortly, unless my heart leads us astray. Often it does, unfortunately. Now, if I remember correctly, wait. If I remember correctly. We go down the shore. There it is. There it is, team. Jesus. God tier no map navigator. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> Bachingling! We did it, team. We actually did it. There we go. Try to tone the epic badass shit today. You got to be able to sleep later. Sorry, Apis. Sorry. Sometimes, sometimes it just can't be contained. Okay. We got 450 carry sauce right now. Let's go. I am now the cart pulling myself. 
That came out a lot weirder. That came out a lot weirder than I had anticipated it to, honestly. Oh, we never started the heals. Uh, let's go back and start them healies. We'll get those in the fermenter. I think I've got about another 15 minutes. I got to, uh, we got to get the heal started. I'm going to try to get this boat made. And we got the jingling. Things are looking good. Cartadrix. Because he's always pulling himself. Here we go. We should get the, we should get the farm flipped. Actually, I don't think that I have enough. Uh, I'm going for about another 15 minutes, Gray. About another, about another 10 minutes, maybe. His mom, his mom brought him to the trampoline park, so I'm gonna go, go pick him up. What, what, what the fuck was I doing? Okay, let's go make that mead real quick. There we go. A little smoky. What the fuck? Okay. Oh my god, I'm in honey short. There is plenty of ventilation. This doesn't make sense. I wonder what trampoline parks are like. Yeah, it's not precisely what you would think. The tra the trampolines are like built into the ground. Hold on. Okay. Oh, how it'd make you feel as a kid? Oh. It would make you feel happy. My son fucking loves the trampoline park. Like we do we do two hours at the trampoline park and he doesn't want to leave. Okay, well, I've got news. We actually cannot uh start we're, we're somehow we're too not gonna talk about it. Uh bronze nails. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this. Okay, so Find what we have. Deer hide. Actually, we should have everything. We should have everything. Grab this. Oh yeah, it's very good exercise. But not only that, they have all they have all types of things there at the tr trampoline park. Am I? Okay. I definitely had a bunch of fine wood. Maybe it's in the cart. Guys, we're going to try hard not to lose the base. Mother fluffer. I set a bunch. No, 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 no. This is not possible. I bet I put it uh, down here so that I wouldn't accidentally use it. This regular wood. Oh, okay. That's also... Oh, God. Please don't tell me. There's no way. I... I th All right. We just need a little bit of fine wood. Let's go get some fine wood and build the boat. We dropped the boat. Um, I still need two straw. I still need two strawberries, guys. 
I know Goldie, I don't, I think that sometimes the fine wood, it just disappears. I think, I don't know. I think it just disappears sometime. I'm going to be honest with you. No, I don't think so. I wouldn't have put it in the coal machine. You know, I think the thing that makes fine wood so scarce is not the scarcity of the tree. It's the evaporation of the wood. I think, I think it's like has a timer and it just disappears sometimes. Corewood, Corewood also has a similar, it has a similar flavor of scarcity and disappearance. I don't know. Fine wood or fine wood? <laughs> yeah. No way it could happen. We'd be finger banging the wood in there like that. Thank you. Thank you. No, I think, I think that the fine, the fine wood, I think it just disappears, guys. There's no other kind of reasonable, rational, logical explanation for where all the wood goes. No, I would have been too careful, Yosemite. Okay, I would have I would have put it I would have put the fine wood in a container that's too far away uh from the kilns, okay? Because ow. Because I'm a careful and thoughtful individual. Hey Sneep Dog, no, we are not on the starter island. We are on an island next to it. Best I can tell. Best I can tell we're on an island that is next to the starter island. I sailed across because I thought that I was going to find something great here. And the only thing that I found was love. And a new base. And a ton of cores. A bajingling. And the will to keep going. I did. I, I, I actually did have to sail to get here. I had to sail a little bit. It wasn't it wasn't a big sail. It was like maybe it was like just too far to swim kind of sail. But I did uh, I did I did build a raft. I don't think I could have swam Goldie. I'm going to be honest with you. I would have drowned and lost all my shit in rage quit. Not but not rage quit, but just start over. You know. You know how we do here. Uh, all right, how many woods do I need here for the carve? I need 15 more. Good news. I've got my bajingling strapped on so we can actually carry a ton of resources now. Yeah, this is the fastest I have ever found this trader. Uh, I stumbled onto them. I actually thought it was the elder summon location when I ran by it because I saw like you know, you like, you just see something that is not normal. You know, it was like the shimmering light. I was like, oh my God, we found the Elder Summon location. And then I was disappointed. I was actually disappointed to find out that it was just, it was just the t-shirt lady. In my first playthrough, the vendor... No. No, I don't think so. <laughs> the vendor I never found. Wait, are you serious? Oh my god. That's actually a little funny. Wait, it's... This one's not the t-shirt lady? Are you sure? Hmm. I'll have to find out. 35 Woody Wood Wood. Let's go. Oh, this is the bag guy. This is the bag man. Okay. Guys, I found all of them so many times I can't keep them straight. That's the problem. Okay, hold on. I have to set the right bearing here because my time is running short. I need to not get lost. We're going to head straight back. We should have everything that we need. Yep, all I need is a workbench and a dream right now. Okay, so this one is Hodor. Okay, got it. We got to keep these guys to my right. There we go. Yo, remember last night when I dropped these logs to point the way to my... Oh, no. Okay, these were not the logs pointing the way. Um... Those were the logs marking that one complete. Okay. In good shape here.
I am so excited to see my son tonight. We are going to do all of the fun things. Yep, we're just uh, up around the bend. And just one more reminder, I will update my schedule in Discord for the week. But tomorrow is a 9 to 4.30 guaranteed. And then we will be doing 11 p.m. streams Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Actually, I got to I got to confirm that I got to I got to confirm that before I say anything. But I'm pretty sure that's what it, it's going to look something like that. Probably ish. I think my I think my house is over here. So yeah, everybody is gonna want to. Uh, everybody's gonna want to clear their schedule tomorrow, nine to four thirty. If you have work, just call in. Just use some of your PTO. Um, if you don't, just set an alarm. You know, get your friends and family. You guys can put me up on the big screen. We're gonna be sailing and we're gonna be adventuring and we're gonna be not getting lost. But if we do get lost, we're, I'm just gonna tunnel vision the elder location, the elder summon location. Um, like literally just nomad black forest to black forest. I think he's close. I think the elder is close and we're going to try not to die. Um, okay. Let's see. I don't know if I'm close. I should be close enough to my workbench here. Drop the old Corve. Hello. You look at this tiny little thing. All right, let's drop that in there. And hold on. What direction am I going to head? That is that is a good question. Um I just hit the M button to look at the map. I think unless I I I'm going to think about it tonight. I kind of want to go I'm going to stick a little close. Okay, so, hold on. Oh, hold on. I need to alt tab. I'm going to show you. Okay. So, our island. I'm going to draw my island right now. Okay. Our island currently. Hold on. Let me draw a small. Our island currently looks like. I'm going to draw what I think my island looks like. Okay. And this is Meadows. Okay. And then there's Black Forest. I think it kind of looks like this is my Black Forest. My base is kind of here. I think that there is another... Like, I came from this direction last night. Okay. This is the island that we've been farming. I know for a fact that the Black Forest stretches around here, stretches around here. The vendor, the vendor is like, like here. This is the vendor. All right. I think I am going to leave here. And I'm going to sail kind of this way here. And I'm going to look. I think there might be some black forest over here that we can see. Now, we can either sail that way or we can sail this way. I, I'm sure. I know for a fact. I think I know for a fact there's some black forest over here. So I'm thinking what we should do is maybe sail clockwise. Come up here. And then and, and check this out. I'm, I'm pretty sure. I think that the swamp... I think that the swamp is maybe... The, the swamp that we can see is kind of here. If you guys want to look at the seed, just look for what I've drawn here. If you guys want to know where I am on the map, look what I've drawn here. This is pretty much like a one-to-one -one scale of exactly, of exactly where we are. 
Well, here's the problem. It's, I think that it is smarter to stick to the shoreline that I know. So if anything happens, we can come home or sail until we can see other Black Forest. Like, I think it just makes more sense to visually inspect Black Forest and then go to it versus sailing off into, like, I don't actually know what's out here, right? Like, if we come in here during the day, I, I have no idea what's out there. It just doesn't make sense to sail straight away from the base. Listen, we have to be strategic. We have to be strategic. Why did you draw a graph and a picture of a mitochondria? Because it's the powerhouse of the cell. Watson, everybody knows that. Where does this... What the fuck is that? There better not be somebody wrecking my shop right now. I'm, off, I'm about to fuck up some grays. Okay, bud. You want to deal with the parry god? Buddy. I am become too strong in this game. I am become too strong. So anyways, yeah, if you guys come out here, there's no good reason to not stick to the shore. Like, we, I can't really see anything out there. I know if we go down the shore this way, we're going to find some swamp. But we're just going to sail up the shore and just look this way to see if we can find some black forest. If we can see some big banana black forest, then we'll go ahead and hop out. We'll, we'll scoot across. We'll hop out. Bada bing. Find the elder location. Bob's your uncle. That's that.